you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, we're calling down throne. Strongholds today, Lord. We're calling down strongholds. We're breaking strongholds in the name of Jesus, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Just bask in his presence. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I need you, Lord. I need you more than ever, Lord. I need you because I'm facing some situations. I'm facing some healing that needs to take place. I'm facing some strongholds, Lord. I'm facing some attacks, Lord. We're going to break the stronghold of the enemy today, Lord. In the name of Jesus. We're going to speak victory in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, why we have an awesome God. Why our God is bigger than any problem that we face. Hallelujah. And every knee shall bow to the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, knowing that we have victory over anything we are dealing with this day in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Praise the name, Lord. Praise the name, Lord. I am a child of God. I am not defeated. With you, O oh Lord, I will never be defeated. The joy of the Lord is my strength. In the midst of turmoil, I will not be defeated. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I will not be defeated. Oh God, you said, call upon me and I will answer you. Show me great and mighty things which you do not know. Oh yes, Lord, I will not be defeated. For I look not at the things that are seen, but at things that are not seen. Things that are seen are temporary, while things that are not seen are eternal. Oh, yes, Lord, that means right now, if I see it, it will be changed. Yes, Lord, whatever condition I'm dealing with, it will be changed in the name of Jesus, because I will not be defeated. Hallelujah. Oh, casting all my care on you, Lord, for you care for me. You shall supply all my need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Whatever I need, Lord, you are. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. You are whatever I need you to be. Praise your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I will not be defeated, Lord. Ah, yes. You did not create a spirit of fear, but of love, of power, and a sound mind. And now to you, O Lord, who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we can ask or think, according to the power that works in us. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will not be defeated in the name of Jesus. I bind every negative spirit, named or unnamed, including the spirits of fear, depression, destruction, anxiety, suicide, witchcraft, and any other dark cults, anger, and I cast them away from our presence into the abyss, away from any of our family members' presence, anybody in our circle, named or unnamed in the name of Jesus, I cast those demonic spirits away from them as well, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, yeah. ah, yes, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I loose every positive spirit into our lives, our family's lives, and anybody in our circle's lives, including the spirits of joy, happiness, prosperity, healing, empowerment, courage, boldness, and victorious living. Hallelujah. 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 And I thank you, Lord. I thank you for your goodness and your mercy. I will walk in victory every single challenge that I face, Lord. I will walk in in victory over that challenge that trauma that whatever it is that comes in my face lord i will walk in victory over it i have been dealing with this from this day forth lord i have been dealing with this in the name of jesus i know i will not be defeated because i am a child of god i will let your light shine through me wherever i go in the name of jesus i decree and declare this confession just spoken is already in motion in my life hallelujah and because i prayed it and i believe that i have received it as you said in mark eleven twenty four. whatever things we pray believe you have received it and we shall have it lord we are believing that we have already received it lord and we decree and declare that everything spoken in this confession right now in the name of jesus 
has come to pass and is in motion right now putting us in victorious positions over every challenge we're facing because we are not defeated hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah oh praise your name praise your name lord hallelujah thank you jesus 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 Every problem, every challenge. 
challenge, every trauma. And there is no fear, for you did not create a spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. I arise today through God's strength to pilot me, God's might to uphold me, God's wisdom to guide me, God's eye to look before me, God's ear to hear me, God's word to speak for me, God's hand to guard me, God's way to lie before me, God's shield to protect me, God's host to save me from snares of devils, from temptations of vices, from everyone who shall wish me ill, afar and near, alone and in multitude. I summon all these powers between me and those evils against every cruel, merciless power that may oppose my body and soul, against incantations of false prophets, against black laws of pagandom, against false laws of heretics, against craft of idolatry, against spells of witches and smiths and wizards, against every knowledge that corrupts man's body and soul. Christ to shield me today against poison, against burning, against drowning, against wounding, so that there may come to me an abundance of reward. Christ with me, Christ before me, Christ behind me, Christ in me, Christ beneath me, Christ above me, Christ on my right, Christ on my left, Christ when I lie down, Christ when I sit down, Christ when I arise, Christ in the heart of every man who thinks of me, Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me. Christ in every eye that sees me. Christ in every ear that hears me. I arise today through a mighty strength of the invocation of the Trinity. Through belief in the threeness. Through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Glory to your name, O Lord. Praise your name. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be exceedingly glad in it. Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be added to you. Call upon me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things which you do not know. He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, You are my refuge and my fortress. My God, in You I will trust. Surely You will deliver me from the snare of the fowler, for the perilous pestilence You will cover with Your feathers, and under Your wings I shall take refuge. Your truth shall be my shield and buckler. 
They shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor the destruction that lays waste at noonday. A thousand may fall at my side, ten thousand at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. Only with my eyes shall I look and see the reward of the wicked. Because I've made the Lord, who is my refuge, even the Most High, my dwelling place. No evil shall befall me, nor shall any plague come near my dwelling. For you shall give your angels charge over me to keep me in all my ways. In their hands they shall bear me up. I will trust in you, Lord, with all my heart, and lean not to my own understanding. In all my ways I acknowledge you, Lord, and know that you will direct my path. For you, O Lord, shall supply all my need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. For I look not at the things that are seen, but at the things that are not seen. For the things that are seen are temporal, while things that are not seen are eternal. By your stripes I am healed, for I walk by faith, not by sight. For without faith it is impossible to please you, and those who come to you must believe that you are, and that you are a rewarder to those who diligently seek you. I cast all my care on you, Lord, for you care for me. I can do all things through Christ, who strengthens me. Behold, you have given me authority to trample over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt me. And you, O oh Lord, will deliver me from every evil work and preserve me for your heavenly kingdom. Delight in you, O Lord, and you will give me the desires of my heart. Wait on you and keep your words, and you will abide with me. Wait on you and keep your words, and you will exalt me to inherit the land. If I abide in you and your words abide in me, then I shall ask what I desire and it shall be done for me. Whatever things I desire, when I pray, I must believe that I receive them, and I shall have them. Now this is the confidence that I have in you, O Lord, that if I ask anything according to your will, you hear me. And if I know that you hear me, Whatever I ask, I know I have the petitions I have asked of you. I rejoice always, pray without ceasing, and everything give thanks, for this is your will for me. I know that you will never leave me, nor forsake me, and that you will be with me even to the end of the age. And these signs shall follow those who believe. In my name they shall cast out demons. They shall speak with new tongues. They will take up serpents, and if they drink anything deadly, it will by no means hurt them. They will lay hands upon the sick, and they will recover. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his namesake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me, thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runs over. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen.
Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your word, Lord. Thank you for your blessings, Lord. Thank you for the victory in everything that I'm facing right now, Lord. I praise your name, Lord. I praise your name, Lord, continuously. I praise you, praise you, praise you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Jehovah Nisi, my victory, my banner. Jehovah Shalom, my peace. Jehovah Tisitkanu, my righteousness. Jehovah Rohai, my shepherd. And Jehovah Shama, my helper. As you said in your word, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And my God shall supply all my need according to his riches and glory through Christ Jesus. And all things are possible to him that believeth. In believing in your word, Lord, I commit to trust in you with all my heart and lean not to my own understanding. In all my ways I acknowledge you, Lord, and you will direct my path. I thank you, Lord for all the many blessings in my life and I thank you in advance for all the blessings I am about to receive for being obedient to your word. I thank you for blessing me, my family, my loved ones, and everyone else who needs prayer this day, named or unnamed, in the name of Jesus. family and all those who are close to me as well as there as well as all those on my prayer list in a special way open supernatural doors in their life today save and set free give them a double portion of your spirit as we take back everything the devil has stolen emotional health physical health finances relationships children, jobs, 
homes, marriages. I canceled every plot, plan, and scheme the enemy has devised against them in the matchless name of Jesus. And I declare that no weapon formed against them will prosper. I speak life into every dead situation. And I thank you that nothing is over until you say it's over. I speak prophetically into all of their lives today and all of their situations. Households are blessed. Health is blessed. Marriages are blessed. Finances are blessed. Jobs are blessed. Children are blessed. Grandchildren are blessed. Our parents are blessed. Siblings are blessed. Ministries are blessed. And our decisions are blessed. Husbands are on the way. Wives are on the way. Mortgages are paid and canceled. And our heart's desires are on the way according to your perfect will and plan for our lives. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, O oh Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you. I just want to bask in your presence, Lord. I feel you all around me right now. I feel your presence. No matter how bad things may seem, Lord, I know you are right here with me every step of the way. Whether I think I see you or not, Lord, I know you are right here with me. Thank you. Praise you, Lord. Praise your mighty name. Every person, known and unknown, in my family, siblings, parents, friends, prayer list, prayer warriors, anyone else not named to the will and mind of Christ, I bind our body, soul, and spirit to the mind, emotions, purposes, and will of God for our lives. I bind our mind will and emotions to the will of God. I bind us to the truth and the blood of Jesus. I bind our minds to the mind of Christ that the very thoughts, feelings, and purposes of his heart would be within our thoughts. I bind our feet to the paths of righteousness that their steps would be steady and sure. I bind each of us to God's timing in our lives. I bind us to the work of the cross with all its mercy, grace, love, forgiveness, and dying to self. I loose every old, wrong, ungodly pattern of thinking, attitude, desire, idea, belief, motivation, habit, and behavior from us. I tear down, crush, smash, and destroy every stronghold associated with these things. I loose any stronghold in our lives that has been justifying and protecting hard feelings against anyone. I loose the strongholds of unforgiveness, fear, and distrust from us. I loose the power and effects of deceptions and lies from us. I loose confusion and blindness of the God of this world from our mind that has kept us from seeing the light of the gospel of Jesus Christ. I call forth every precious word of scripture that has ever entered into our mind and heart that it would rise up in power within us. In the name of Jesus, I loose the power and effects of any harsh or hard words, word curses spoken to 
about or by us. I loose all generational bondages and associated strongholds from us. I loose all effects and bondages and associated strongholds from us that may have been caused by mistakes we have made. Father, in the name of Jesus, I crush, smash, and destroy generational bondages of any kind from mistakes made at any point between generations. I destroy them right here, right now. They will not bind and curse any more members of these families. I bind the strong man Satan that we may spoil his house, taking back sevenfold every material and spiritual possession he has wrongfully taken from us. I loose the enemy's influence over every part of our body, soul, and spirit. I loose, crush, smash, and destroy every evil device he may try to bring into our sphere of influence during this day. I loose all negative influences of the world from us. I crush, smash all the deceptions the enemy may try to use to confuse us. I tear apart, wreck, crack, crush, and rip asunder the effects of the enemy in every area of our lives. Finances, families, homes, work, and businesses. I bind and loose these people in Jesus' name. God has given me the keys and the authority to do so, and I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. Praise your name. Glory to your name. Glory to your name, Lord. Praise your name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, I thank you for this day. I thank you for my being able to see and to hear this morning. I am blessed because you are a forgiving God and an understanding God. You have done so much for me, and you keep on blessing me. Forgive me this day, for I have sinned. I ask now for forgiveness. Keep me safe from all danger and harm. Let me start this day with a new attitude and plenty of gratitude. Let me make the best of each and every day and give my best in all that is put before me. Clear my mind that I can hear from you. Broaden my mind that I can accept all things. Let me continue to see sin through your eyes and acknowledge it as evil. And when I sin, let me repeat, let me repent and confess with my mouth my wrongdoing and receive the forgiveness of God. And when this world closes in on me, let me remember to slip away and find a quiet place to pray. It is the best response when I am pushed beyond my limits. I know that when I pray, you listen to my heart. Continue to use me to do thy will. Continue to bless me that I may be a blessing to others. Keep me strong that I may help the weak. Keep me uplifted that I may have words of encouragement for others. I pray for those that are lost and can't find their way. I pray for those that are misjudged 
and misunderstood. I pray for those who refuse to share a word from you. I pray for those who don't know you intimately. I pray for those who will not share the word with others. I pray for those that don't believe. But I thank you that I believe that you change people and you change things. I pray for all my sisters and brothers, for each and every family member in their households. I pray for peace, love, and joy in their homes, and that they are out of debt and all their needs are met. I pray that these words be received into the hearts of every person who hears this and confesses them willingly. This is my prayer. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, to your way. Hallelujah. I send for the holy angels of God right now. They are commissioned to minister on behalf of the heirs of salvation. I am an heir of salvation. I am washed in the blood of Christ. I am blood bought, Holy Ghost filled, and fire baptized. I'm not waiting to get into the kingdom of God. I'm in the kingdom now, and the kingdom is in me. The king has come to live in me. I have stepped out of darkness into light. I've been translated from the kingdom of darkness into the kingdom of light. The love of God has been shed abroad in my heart by Christ Jesus. I have the covenant right that empowers me to stand firm and to prophesy. I have the covenant right to declare the holy angels of God to go forth in the fields and bring in my harvest. In the name and authority of Jesus, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Glory, Lord. In the name of Jesus, I am more, more than a conqueror, even in darkness. Right now, I prepare my way with the anointed word of God. I have been honored with the right to execute judgment written in Jesus' name. And when I speak God's word, even in the midst of darkness, I shall have light. Victory all the time. That's mine. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, this is the victory that overcomes the world, even my faith. I overcome the world with victory Jesus has obtained. I maintain victory Jesus has obtained. In the name of Jesus, I declare that right now, 
my God always causes me to have the decisive, settled victory in everything through the anointing. I always have victory over my enemies because God shows favor to me. In the name of Jesus, I will change my focus from the world to the word and expect a miracle. I expect a miracle every day. God always causes me to have victory every day. Miracles are available every day. Therefore, I expect a miracle every day. In the name of Jesus, I am an overcomer. I have been born of God. This is the victory that overcomes the world, even my faith. In the name of Jesus, my part of the fellowship of his love is the key to victory that Jesus obtained. In the name of Jesus, offenses will never hurt me. I declare that I am not self-assured. I am God assured. In the name of Jesus, my victory comes by refusing to judge by what my eyes see and what my ears hear. But my victory comes by trusting what God has promised me. In the name of Jesus, I declare I have victory all the time. In the name of Jesus, I am a son of God and I declare now the battle will soon become a meal. It will become an experience that will nourish and build me up spiritually. In the name of Jesus, I declare breakthrough, come forth. I command you, let the redeemed of the Lord come forth in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, I will maintain that victory. Thank you, Father. I am triumphant over the enemy. I am an overcomer. I am a victor in the anointed Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I don't have because I don't expect. But now, I expect. Not every now and then, but every day. Every day, I expect a miracle. Every day, I expect a favor from God. Every day I expect triumph, victory, and success. It's been made available. I have an expected end and it shall not be cut off. In the name of Jesus, miracles are available. Increase is available. Healing is available. And joy is available. In the name of Jesus, I expect what has been made available to me by the anointed Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I declare I have victory all the time. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, O oh Lord. Thank you, Lord. against flesh and blood but against principalities against powers against rulers of the darkness of this age against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places 
Therefore, I take the whole armor of God, that I may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all, to stand. Stand, therefore, having girded my waist with truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, having shod my feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace, above all, taking the shield of faith with which I shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked one, and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, being watchful to this end with all perseverance and supplication for all the saints. O oh Lord, you have made a hedge around me, around my household, and around all that I have on every side. The angel of the Lord encamps around all those who fear him and delivers them. The Lord shall be a wall of fire around me. Do not be afraid, says the Lord. I am your shield. You, O Lord, are a shield for me, my glory, and the one who lifts up my head. No weapon formed against me shall prosper, and every tongue which rises against me in judgment I shall condemn. I will not be afraid of sudden terror, nor of trouble when it comes, for the Lord will be my confidence and will keep my foot from being caught. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivers me out of them all. Call upon you, O Lord, in the day of trouble, and you will deliver me, and I shall glorify you. Cast my burden on you, Lord, and you will sustain me. You shall never permit the righteous to be moved. And you, O Lord, will deliver me from every evil work and preserve me for your heavenly kingdom. Do not fear, for those who are with us are more than those who are with them. Greater is he that is in me than he who is in the world. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Whatever you bound on earth, be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. Therefore, Satan, in the name of Jesus, I bind you and all demonic forces right now. I bind all the spirits of retribution, revenge, and retaliation who may try to attack the person listening to this message right now. And I loose you demonic forces from your assignment against me, those listening to this message, our finances, our careers, our family, and all those who are close to us. In the mighty name of Jesus, I put a hedge of protection around everyone just named. And those unnamed who are listening to this message, I command the angels to encamp around all of us and all of our affairs every hour of the day and night. For behold, you have given us the authority to trample over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt us. The Lord blesses me and keeps me. The Lord makes his face to shine upon me and be gracious to me. Lord lifts up his countenance upon me and gives me peace. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise your mighty name. Praise your name. Oh, you said your word, Lord. Psalms 103. Bless the Lord, O my soul, 
and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Who forgives all your iniquities? Who heals all your diseases? Who redeems your life from destruction? Who crowns you with loving kindness and tender mercies? Who satisfies your mouth with good things? So that your youth is renewed like the eagles. The Lord executes righteousness and justice for all who are oppressed. He made known his ways to Moses, his acts to the children of Israel. The Lord is merciful and gracious, slow to anger and abounding in mercy. He will not always strive with us, nor will he keep his anger forever. He has not dealt with us according to our sins, nor punished us according to our iniquities. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy toward those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far he removed our transgressions from us. As a father pities his children, so the Lord pities those who fear him. For he knows our frame. He remembers that we are dust. For as man, his days like grass, a flower of the field, and so he flourishes. For the wind passes over it, and it is gone. But the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him, and his righteousness to his children's children. To such as keep his covenant, to those who remember his commandments to do them, the Lord has established his throne in heaven, and his kingdom rules over all. Bless the Lord, you his angels, who excel in strength, who do his word, heeding to the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all you his hosts, you ministers of his do his pleasure. Bless the Lord all his works in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, O oh Lord. Thank you. I thank you, thank you, thank you. Hallelujah. some things now. Now in the name of Jesus I release my faith now and I declare right now I will not turn loose what's mine. Healing is mine. I am an heir of healing. I have a right to it. Jesus has given it to me and in the name of Jesus I will not give away what he has given to me. And now I declare boldly before all of heaven that I do not plan for one moment to give up, to cave in, and to quit. But I do plan to receive everything that has been promised in the Word of God. And I declare healing in my life, healing in my body, healing in my mind. I boldly say, I am healed 
I am healed. I am healed right now in the name of Jesus. The gospel that I have heard is the power of God into salvation. I confess Jesus Christ is Lord over my life, spirit, soul, and body. I receive the power of God to make me sound, whole, delivered, saved, and healed right now. I act on the word of God and I receive the power of God. Sickness, disease, pain, I resist you in the name of Jesus. You are not the will of God. I enforce the word of God on you. I will not tolerate you in my life. Leave my presence. I will never allow you back. My days of sickness and disease are over. I am healed. 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 I am the healed protecting my health. I am saved. The power of sickness and disease has been broken forever over my life. Jesus bore my sickness, my weakness, and my pain. I am forever free. Sickness shall no longer lord over me. Sin shall no longer lord it over me. Fear shall no longer lord it over me. Satan shall no longer lord it over me. I have a covenant of peace and it shall not be removed. I have been redeemed from the curse of the law. I proclaim my freedom in Jesus name. Today the gospel is the power of God to me. Under salvation I receive the gospel. I act on the gospel. I am made whole in Jesus' name. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. I am the redeemed of the Lord. I have said it, and it is so in Jesus' name. God is healing me right now. Every ache and pain in my body is healed right now in Jesus' name. The blood of Jesus is covering me from head to toe. Every cell in my body is being healed right now by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Stress is leaving my body. Aches and pains are leaving my body in Jesus' name. Healing is taking place in areas that I don't even know had any dis-ease within them. Healing is taking place right now. In Jesus' name. Lord, I thank you for my healing. Thank you for healing my body, my, my finances, my life, my relationships, my family. Thank you, Lord, for healing everything in my life right now. Every debt, financial obligation, loan, any financial situation, I lift them all up to you right now, Lord, so that the devil cannot use them against me to steal my joy and my praise. As you say in Romans 10:17, faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. 
Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor stands in the path of sinners, nor sits in the seat of the scornful, but his light, his delight, is in the law of the Lord. And in his law he meditates day and night. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water. And what brings forth its fruit in its season? Whose leaf also shall not wither. And whatever he does shall prosper. Psalms 1, 1 through 3. 3 John 1 and 2 says, Beloved, I pray that you may prosper in all things and be in health just as your soul prospers. Malachi 3.10, Bring all the tithes into the storehouse that there may be food in my house. And try me now, says the Lord, if I will not open for you the windows of heaven and pour out for you such blessings that there will not be enough room to receive it. Luke 6.38 Give and it will be given to you. Pressed down, shaken together, and running over will be put into your bosom. For with the same measure that you use, it will be measured back to you. Second Corinthians 9, 6-9 But this I say, he who sows sparingly will also reap sparingly. He who sows bountifully will also reap bountifully. Let each one give as he purposes in his heart, not grudgingly, nor of necessity, for God loves a cheerful giver. And God is able to make all grace abound toward you, that you, having all sufficiency in all things, may have an abundance for every good work. I no longer operate by the world system of debt cancellation, but by God's system of seed time and harvest. Galatians 6, 7-9 Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. For whatever a man sows, that also will he reap. I believe that I have sowed into good ground. And I believe that when I sow seed into good ground, I reap an immediate hundredfold return in the name of Jesus. Habakkuk 2, 23, write the vision and make it plain on a tablet, that he may run who reads it. For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it will speak and it will not lie. Though it tarries, wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tarry. Psalms 35, 27. Let them shout for joy and be glad who favor my righteous cause. Let them say continually, the Lord, let the Lord be magnified, who has pleasure in the prosperity of his servants. Therefore, as his servant, I declare I am out of debt. All my needs are met. I have plenty more to put in store. I have a heart. I have a hearing heart because I meditate on God's word daily. As a result, I hear God's word. I hear his voice clearly and I operate in his wisdom and anointing. Isaiah 30 verse 21, your ears shall hear a word behind you saying, this is the way, walk in it. Whenever you turn to the right, or left. Proverbs 4, 23, keep your heart with all diligence, for out of it flows the issues of life. Therefore, I refuse to allow anything to come before my eyes, in my ears, or out of my mouth that does not line up with the word of God. I purpose to guard my heart diligently by bringing every thought, action, or desire into submission to the word of God, casting down, as it says in 2 Corinthians 10, 5, casting down every argument and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God, bringing every thought into captivity 
to the obedience of Christ. Proverbs 36, 11, If they obey and serve Him, they shall spend their days in prosperity and their years in pleasures. But if they do not obey, they shall perish by the sword and they shall die without knowledge. Psalms 25, 12 through 14, Who is the man that fears the Lord? Him shall he teach in the way he chooses. He himself shall dwell in prosperity and his descendants shall inherit the earth. The secret of the Lord is with those who fear him and he will show them his salvation. Deuteronomy 28, 1 through 14, if you obey the Lord your God and faithfully keep all his commands that I am giving you today, he will make you greater than any other nation on earth. Obey the Lord your God and all these blessings will be yours. The Lord will bless your towns and your fields. The Lord will bless you with many children, with abundant crops, with many cattle and sheep. The Lord will bless your grain and the food you prepare for them. The Lord will bless everything you do. The Lord will defeat your enemies when they attack you. They will attack you from one direction, but run from you in all directions. The Lord your God will bless your work and fill your barns with grain. He will bless you in the land that he has given you. The Lord your God will make you the leader among nations and not a follower. You will always prosper and never fail if you obey faithfully all his commandments that I am giving you this day. But you must never disobey them in any way or worship or serve any other gods. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Thank you, Jesus, for this time, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for allowing me to bask in your presence. But even though I know this time is over right now, that you are with me 24-7, Lord. I thank you for that, Lord. I praise your name continuously, and I give you praise. Hallelujah. Lord, bless the reading of his word. And may the Lord bless us this day in giving quality time to the Lord. May the Lord bless you and keep you. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. We're calling down strongholds today, Lord. We're calling down strongholds. We're breaking strongholds in the name of Jesus, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Just bask in His presence. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Lord. I need you because I'm facing some situations. I'm facing some healing that needs to take place. I'm facing some strongholds, Lord. I'm facing some attacks, Lord. We're going to break the stronghold of the enemy today, Lord. In the name of Jesus. We're going to speak victory in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, why we have an awesome God. Why our God is bigger than any problem that we face. Hallelujah. And every knee shall bow to the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, knowing that we have victory over anything we are dealing with this day in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Praise the name, Lord. Praise the name, Lord. I am a child of God. I am not defeated. With you, O oh Lord, I will never be defeated. The joy of the Lord is my strength. In the midst of turmoil, I will not be defeated. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I will not be defeated. O oh God, you said, call upon me and I will answer you. Show me great and mighty things which you do not know. Oh yes, Lord, I will not 
be defeated. For I look not at the things that are seen, but at things that are not seen. Things that are seen are temporary, while things that are not seen are eternal. Oh, yes, Lord, that means right now, if I see it, it will be changed. Yes, Lord, whatever condition I'm dealing with, it will be changed in the name of Jesus, because I will not be defeated. Hallelujah. I'll casting all my care on you, Lord, for you care for me. You shall supply all my need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Whatever I need, Lord, you are. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. You are whatever I need you to be. Praise your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I will not be defeated, Lord. Ah, yes. You did not create a spirit of fear, but of love, of power, and a sound mind. And now to you, Lord, who's able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we can ask or think according to the power that works in us. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will not be defeated in the name of Jesus. I bind every negative spirit, named or unnamed, including the spirits of fear, depression, destruction, anxiety, suicide, witchcraft, and any other dark cults, anger, and I cast them away from our presence into the abyss, away from any of our family members' presence, anybody in our circle, named or unnamed in the name of Jesus, I cast those demonic spirits away from them as well, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, yeah. ah, yes, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I loose every positive spirit into our lives, our family's lives, and anybody in our circle's lives, including the spirits of joy, happiness, prosperity, healing, empowerment, courage, boldness, and victorious living. Hallelujah. 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 And I thank you, Lord. I thank you for your goodness and your mercy. I will walk in victory every single challenge that I face, Lord. I will walk in in victory over that challenge, that trauma, that whatever it is that comes in my face, Lord, I will walk in victory over it. I have been dealing with this from this day forth, Lord. I have been dealing with this in the name of Jesus. I know I will not be defeated because I am a child of God. I will let your light shine through me wherever I go in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare this confession just spoken is already in motion in my life. Hallelujah. And because I prayed it, and I believe that I have received it, as you said in Mark eleven twenty four. whatever things we pray, believe you have received it, and we shall have it. Lord, we are believing that we have already received it, Lord. And we decree and declare that everything spoken in this confession right now, in the name of Jesus, has come to pass. And as in motion right now, putting us in victorious positions over every challenge we're facing because we are not defeated. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, praise your name. Praise your name, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. 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 In the name of Jesus, I bind the wills of every person in my circle, Lord. Known family members, close friends, relatives, everyone that is close to me or has any knowledge of me, Lord. Oh, I just want to put a, put them into my circle, Lord. I bind them to the will and the mind of Christ. I bind our bodies, our soul, our spirit to the mind, emotions, purposes, and will of God for our lives. I bind our mind, will, and emotions to the will of God. I bind us to the truth and the blood of Jesus. I bind our minds to the mind of Christ that the very thoughts, feeling, and purposes of his heart would be within our thoughts. I bind our feet to the paths of righteousness, that their steps would be steady and sure. I bind each of us to God's timing in our lives. I bind us to the work of the cross with all its mercy, grace, love, forgiveness, and dying to self. I loose every old, wrong, ungodly pattern of thinking, attitude, desire, idea, belief, motivation, 
habit and behavior from us. I tear down, crush, smash, and destroy every stronghold associated with these things. I loose any stronghold in our lives that has been justifying and protecting hard feelings against anyone. I loose the strongholds of unforgiveness, fear, and distrust from us. I loose the power of effects, uh, the power and effects of deceptions, lies, and anything else from us. I lose confusion and blindness of the God of this world from our mind that has kept us from seeing the light of the gospel of Jesus Christ. I call forth every precious word of scripture that has ever entered into our mind and heart that it would rise up in power within us. In the name of Jesus, I loose the power and effects of any harsh or hard words, word curses spoken to, about, or by us. I loose all generational bondages and associated strongholds from us. I loose all effects and bondages and associated strongholds from us that may have been caused by mistakes we made in the past. Father, in the name of Jesus, I crush, smash, and destroy generational bondages of any kind from mistakes made at any point between any generations. I destroy them right now, right here, right now. They will not bind and curse any more members of my families, of these families, of everyone being included right now. I bind the strong man, Satan, that we may spoil his house, taking back sevenfold every material and spiritual possession he has wrongfully taken from us. I loose the enemy's influence over every part of our body, soul, and spirit. I loose, crush, smash, and destroy all evil devices he may try to bring into our sphere of influence during this day. I loose all negative influences of the world from us. I crush and smash all the deceptions the enemy may try to use to confuse us. I tear apart, crush, crack, and rip asunder the effects of the enemy in every area of our lives, finances, family, health, home, work, businesses and anything else named or unnamed that we have anything to do with whatsoever i bind and loose all the people in this circle lord in the name of jesus i have given us the keys god you have given us the keys lord you have given us the keys and the authority to do so i can do all things through christ who strengthens us hallelujah oh in the name of jesus praise yes thank you jesus Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Oh, Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Ah, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I command the morning and I take hold of the ends of the earth and shake the wicked out of it. Job 38, 12. I have dominion over the devil in the morning psalms 49 14 lord make the outgoing of the morning to rejoice psalm 65 8 i receive your loving kindness every morning psalms 143 9 release the beauty of your holiness from the womb of the morning psalms 110 3 let your light break forth in my life as the morning, Psalms 58, 8, let your judgments come upon the enemy morning by morning, Isaiah 28, 19. Lord, your going forth is prepared as the morning, and we pray that you will come as the rain and the latter and the former rain upon the earth, Hosea 6, 3. Lord, you visit me every morning, Job 7, 8. 18. Lord, you awaken me morning by morning. You waken my ear to hear as the learned Isaiah 50 verse 4. I will not be afraid of the arrow that flies by day, nor the terror that comes by night. Psalms 91 5. Lord, show forth your salvation in my life from day to day. Psalms 96 2. I bind 
Lilith, the night hag, the night owl, is in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 34, 14. Ha, let's Yes, Lord. Lord, you have delivered me and my soul from the death and my feet from falling. Psalms 56, 13. Preserve my soul, for I am holy. Psalms 86, 2. Re rejoice my soul, for I lift my soul unto you. Psalms 86, 4. Lord, your comfort delights in my soul oh yes psalm 94 19 i break the power of all negative words spoken against my soul psalms 109 20 return unto your rest O my soul psalms 116 7 my soul shall live and praise the lord psalms 119 175 my soul is escaped as a bird out of the snare of the fowler psalms 124 7 strengthen me with your strength strengthen me with the strength in my soul psalms 138 3 destroy all of them that affect my soul psalms 143 12 let your fear come upon every soul in my city acts 2 43 i will prosper and be in health even as my soul prospers third john 1 and 2 i pray my soul will be preserved blameless unto the coming of the Lord. 1 Thessalonians 5, 23. Satiate my soul with fatness. Jeremiah 31, 14. My soul will be joyful in the Lord. You have covered me with the garments of salvation and covered me with the robe of righteousness. Isaiah 61, 10. I break all ungodly soul ties and pray for godly soul ties that will bring blessings into my life. 1 Samuel 18, 1. Hallelujah. And I loose my soul from any oaths, inner vows, and curses that would bind it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I have the keys of the kingdom, and whatever I bind on earth is bound in heaven and whatever I loose on earth is loosed in heaven Matthew 16 19 I bind the kings in chains and the nobles with fetters of iron Psalms 149 8 I bind the strong man and spoil his goods Matthew 12 29 I bind Le the Leviathan and all proud spirits arrayed against my life Job 41 5 I bind the principalities powers rulers of darkness in this world and spiritual wickedness in high places ephesians 6 12 i bind all sickness and disease released against my mind or body let the exiles be loosed isaiah 51 14 let the prisoners be loosed psalms 146 7 loose those appointed to death psalms 102 20 i loose my neck from all bands isaiah 52 2. I loose myself from the bands of wickedness. Isaiah 58, 6. I loose myself from the bands of Orion. Job 38, 31. I loose myself from all bonds. Psalms 116, 16. I loose my mind, my will, my emotions from every assignment and spirit of darkness in the name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Let the spirits of lust and perversion be destroyed with your fire. Genesis nineteen twenty four. Release the spirit of burning to burn up the works of darkness in Psalms one forty ten. Let your flame burn up wicked spirits. Psalms one hundred six eighteen. Let your glory kindle a burning light. Burning like the fire, like a fire, Lord. Let your glory kindle a burning light. The burning of a fire, Isaiah 10, 16. Cause your glorious voice to be heard. Show lightning down your arm with a flame of devouring fire and with scattering tempest and hailstone, Isaiah 30, 30. Let Babylon be as stubble. Let your fire burn them. Let them not be able to deliver themselves from the power of the flame, Isaiah 47, 14. Lord, come and rebuke your enemies with flames of fire, Isaiah 66, 15. Let all flesh see 
your fire released ezekiel 20 48 create upon zion a flaming fire by night isaiah 4 5 let the fire of your presence be released in my life psalms 97 5 let demons be exposed and cast out with your fire acts 28 3 release your hot thunderbolts against the enemy psalm 78 48 cast forth lightning and scatter the enemy psalms 144 6 let your light be for fire and your holy ghost one let your light be for fire and your holy one for flame to burn Burn the briars and thorns in my life. Isaiah 10, 17. I loose my city and region from every assignment of hell. I loose my finances from every spirit of poverty, debt, and lack. I loose myself from all generational curses and hereditary spirits. Galatians 3, 13. I loose myself from every assignment of witchcraft sorcery or divination i loose myself from every spoken curse and negative word spoken against my life in the name of jesus oh yes lord ah yes lord thank you jesus thank you jesus deliver me from evil matthew 6 13 i pray that you would Keep me from evil. First Chronicles 4.10 No evil shall touch me. Job 5.19 Put to shame them that wish me evil. Psalms 40.14 Let no evil disease cleave to my body. Psalms 41.8 uh, 41, I will not be afraid of evil tidings. Psalms 112.7 I will not be visited by evil. Proverbs 19.23 I refrain my feet from every evil way that I might keep your word. Psalms 119.101 Preserve me from all evil. Psalms 121.7 Deliver me from the evil man. Psalms 141. Ha ha. 140 verse 1 Let people be healed of plagues and evil spirits. Luke 7, 21, in the name of Jesus, I pray that you would keep me from evil. John 17 and 15. Oh, yes, Lord. Let evil spirits be cast out. Acts 19, 12. I will not be overcome with evil, but I will overcome evil with good. Romans 12, 21. I put on the whole armor of God that I might stand in the evil day. Ephesians 6, 13. I cancel all the plans and evil forces of evils sent against my life. Let the works of evil be burned by your holy fire. Let men repent of evil and turn to righteousness. Let no evil be established in my life and let your righteousness be established. I loose myself from all evil doers and evil soul ties in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I break and disannul all godly covenants, oaths, pledges I have made with my lips in the name of Jesus. I renounce and break all ungodly oaths made by my ancestors to idols demons false religions or ungodly organizations in the name of jesus matthew 5 33 i break and disannul all covenants with death and hell made by my ancestors in the name of jesus i break and annul all ungodly covenants made with idols or demons by any ancestors any ancestors in the name of jesus exodus 23 32 i break and disannul all blood covenants made through the sacrifice that would affect my life in the name of Jesus. I command all demons that claim any legal right to my life through covenants to come out in the name of Jesus. I break and disannul any covenant made with any false gods, demons, through the occult involvement and witchcraft in the name of Jesus. I break and disannul all spirit marriages that would cause incubus or succubus demons to attack my life in the name of Jesus. I break and annul any marriage 
to any demon that would affect my life in the name of Jesus. Hashabah. I break all agreements with hell in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 28, 18. I have a covenant with God through the blood of Jesus Christ. I am joined to the Lord and I am one spirit. I have a covenant with God through the blood of Jesus Christ and I break all ungodly covenants and I renew my covenant with God through the blood and body of Jesus Christ. I divorce myself from any demon that would claim my life through any ancestral covenants in the name of Jesus. I bind and cast out any family demon that would follow my life through ancestral covenants in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I am redeemed from the curse of the law. Galatians 3.13 I break all generational curses of pride, lust, perversion, rebellion, witchcraft, idolatry, poverty, rejection, fear, confusion, addiction, death, destruction in the name of Jesus. I command all generational spirits that came into my life during conception, in the womb, in the birth canal, through the umbilical cord to come out in the name of Jesus. I break all spoken curses, negative words that I have spoken over my life in the name of Jesus. I break all spoken curses and negative words spoken over my life by others, including those in authority in the name of Jesus. I command all ancestral spirits of Freemasonry, idolatry, witchcraft, false religion, polygamy, lust, perversions to come out of my life in the name of Jesus. I command all hereditary spirits of lust, rejection, fear, sickness, infirmity, disease, anger, hatred, confusion, failure, and poverty to come out of my life in the name of Jesus. I break the legal rights of all generational spirits operating behind a curse in the name of Jesus. You have no legal right in my life. I bind and rebuke all familiar spirits, spirit guides that would try to operate in my life from my ancestors in the name of Jesus. I renounce all false beliefs and philosophies inherited by my ancestors in the name of Jesus. I break all curses on my finances from any ancestor and who from any ancestors that cheated or mishandled money in the name of Jesus. I break all curses of sickness and disease and command all inherited sickness to leave my body right now in the name of Jesus through Jesus. Oh yes Lord through Jesus my family is blessed. Genesis 12, 3, I renounce all pride inherited from my ancestors in the name of Jesus. I break all oaths, vows, pacts made with the devil by any ancestor in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I break all curses by agents of Satan spoken against my life in secret in the name of Jesus. Psalms 10, 7, I break all all written curses that would affect my life in the name of Jesus. Second Chronicles 34, 24. I break every time released curse that would activate in my life as I grow older in the name of Jesus. I break every curse Balaam hired against my body in the name of Jesus. Lord, turn every curse spoken against my life into a blessing. Nehemiah 13, 2, hallelujah. I break all generational rebellion that would cause me to resist the Holy Spirit. Acts 7, verse 51. Hallelujah. I break all curses of death spoken by people in authority in my nation, over my nation, in the name of Jesus. I break curses of death spoken against America by people from other nations, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I am the seed of Abraham through Jesus Christ, and I receive the blessing of Abraham, Lord. In blessings, in blessing me, Lord, bless me. And in multiplying, multiply me as the stars of heaven and as a sand 
on the seashore. Let your showers of blessings be upon my life. Ezekiel 34, 26. Turn every curse sent my way into a blessing. Nehemiah 13, 2. Hallelujah. Let your blessing make me rich. Proverbs 10, 22. Let all nations call me blessed. Malachi 3, 12. Let all nations call me blessed. Again, Luke 1, 48. I am a son of the blessed mark 1461 i live in the kingdom of the blessed mark 1110 my sins are forgiven and i am blessed romans 4 7 lord you daily load me with benefits psalm 68 19 i am chosen by god and i am blessed psalm 65 4 my seed is blessed Hallelujah. My seed is blessed. Psalms 37, 26. Let me inherit the land. Psalms 37, 22. I am part of a holy nation and I am blessed. Psalms 33, 12. Lord, bless my latter end and greater. Lord, bless my latter end greater than my former job 42 12 hallelujah lord let your presence bless my life second samuel 6 11 i drink the cup of blessing first corinthians 10 16 lord bless me and and cause your face to shine upon me that your way may be known upon the earth and hallelujah starving ha and your saving Health among the nations. Let me say that again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, bless me and cause your face to shine upon me that your way may be known upon the earth and your saving health among all nations. Hallelujah. Let your hand yield increase. Let ends of the earth fear you. Psalms 67. I know your favor because. My enemies do not triumph over me. Psalms 41, 11. Lord, be favorable unto my land. Psalms 85, 1. Lord, grant me life and favor. Job 10, 12. In your favor, Lord, make my mountain stand strong. Psalms 37. Lord, I entreat your favor. Psalms 45, 12. Let your favor cause my horn to be exalted. Psalms 89, 17. Lord, this is my set time for favor. Psalms 102, 13. Remember me, O Lord, with the favor that you bring unto your children and visit me with your salvation. Psalms 106, 4. Lord, I entreat your favor. With my whole heart, Psalms 119.58, let your favor be upon my life as a cloud of the latter rain, Psalms 16.15, let your beauty be opened upon my life and let me be well favored, Genesis 29.17, I am highly favored, Luke 1.28, Lord, let me receive extraordinary favor hallelujah in jesus name praise your name thank you thank you jesus i break all generational curses of pride rebellion lust poverty witchcraft idolatry death destruction failure sickness infirmity fear schizophrenia and rejection in the name of jesus i command all generational and hereditary spirits operating in my life through curses to be bound and cast out in the name of jesus i command all spirits of lust perversion adultery fornication uncleanliness immorality to come out of my sexual character in the name of jesus i command all spirits of hurt rejection fear anger wrath sadness depression discouragement grief bitterness and unforgiveness to come out of my emotions in the name of jesus i command all spirits of confusion forgetfulness mind control mental illness doubt double-mindedness fantasy pain pride and memory recall to come out of my mind in the name of jesus i break all curses of schizophrenia and command all spirits of double-mindedness rejection rebellion and root of bitterness to come out in the name of jesus i command all spirits of guilt shame and condemnation come out of my conscience in the name of jesus i command all spirits of 
pride, stubbornism, disobedience, rebellion, self-will, selfishness, and arrogance to come out of my will. In the name of Jesus, I command all spirits of addiction to come out of my appetite. In the name of Jesus, Hashabadihishi, I command all spirits of witchcraft, sorcery, divination, and occult to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my head. Hallelujah. My head, my eyes, my mouth, my tongue, and throat to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating my chest and my lungs to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my back and spine to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my stomach, navel, and abdomen come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my heart, spleen, kidneys, liver, and pancreas come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my sexual organs come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my hand, arms, legs, feet come out in the name of Jesus. I command and all demons operating in my skeletal system, including my bones, joints, knees, and elbows, come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my glands and in endocrine glands and in my endocrine system to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my blood and circulatory system come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits operating in my muscles and my muscular system come out in the name of Jesus. I command command all religious spirits of doubt, unbelief, error, heresy, and tradition that came in through religion to come out in the name of Jesus. I command all spirits from my past that are hindering me and the past and present and the future to come. I, I command you to come out right now in the name of Jesus. I command all the ancestral spirits that entered through my ancestors come out in the name of Jesus. I command all hidden spirits hiding in any part of my life come out in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Lord, teach my hands to war and my fingers to fight psalms 144 1 lord i am your end time warrior use me as your weapon against the enemy second chronicles 11 1 the weapons of my warfare are not carnal but mighty through you to the pulling down of strongholds second corinthians 10 4 satan you have lost the war of heaven, Revelations 12, 7. Let all the enemies that make war with the Lamb be destroyed, Revelation 17, 14. I do not war after this flesh, but after the Spirit, 2 Corinthians 10, 3. Lord, thunder upon my enemy. Release your voice. Hail stones and coals of fire, Psalms 18, 13. Send out your arrows and scatter them. Shoot out your light and discomfit them. Ha la Psalm eighteen fourteen Deliver me from my strong enemy, from them that are too strong for me. Psalm eighteen seventeen Deliver me and bring me into a large place. Psalms eighteen nineteen I am your battle axe and weapon of war. Jeremiah fifty one twenty You have given me the necks of my enemies, and I will destroy them in the name of Jesus. Psalms eight 1840. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, yes, Lord. I am your anointed, and you have given me great deliverance. Psalms 1850. I will beat them. I will beat them small as dust and cast them out as mire in the streets. Psalms 1842. I have pursued my enemies and overtaken them. I did not turn until they were consumed psalms 1837 i have wounded them and they're not able to arise they have fallen under my feet psalms 1838 i will tread upon the lion and the adder the young lion and the dragon i trample underfoot psalms 9113 i tread upon serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy nothing shall by any means hurt me luke 1019 I tread down the wicked 
and they are ashes under my feet. In Malachi 4.3, I will arise and thresh and beat into pieces the enemy. Micah 4.13, I rebuke every wild boar of the field. In the name of Jesus, Psalms 80.13, I rebuke every spirit that creeps forth from the forest. Psalms 104.20, I rebuke every beast of the forest that comes to devour. Isaiah 56.19. 56, 9. I rebuke every lion of the forest that comes to slay. Jeremiah 5, 6. I close the door to every demonic rat that would attempt to come into my life. In the name of Jesus, Isaiah 66, 17. I bind and cast out every thief that would try to steal my finances. In the name of Jesus, John 10, 10. I bind and cast out any spirit that would try to steal my joy. In the name of Jesus, I bind, expose, and cast out any demon that would try to do anything by stealth, undetected, to come into my life. In the name of Jesus, Second Samuel 19, 3. Lord, cleanse my temple. Drive out any thief from my from my life. John two, fourteen and fifteen. Lord, lift up a standard against any flood. Lift up a standard against any flood the enemy would try to bring into my life. Isaiah fifty nine nineteen. I bind and cast out familiar spirits that would try to operate in my life. In the name of Jesus, Isaiah eight. 19. I bind and rebuke any demon that would try to block my way in the name of Jesus. Matthew 8, 28. I remove all leaven of malice and wickedness from my life. 1 Corinthians 5, 8. I rebuke and cast out any frog-like spirit from my life in the name of Jesus. Revelation 16, 3. I bind and rebuke devils in high places in the name of Jesus. 2 Chronicles eleven fifteen. I break off any fellowship with devils through sin, the flesh, or sacrifice in the name of Jesus. 1 Corinthians 10, 20. I command all the devils to leave my children in the name of Jesus. Mark seven twenty nine. Lord, expose any human devils in my life. In the name of Jesus, John 6, verse 70. Hallelujah. Lord, expose any children of the devil that would try to come into the church. Acts 13, 10. In the name of Jesus, let every spirit hiding from me to be exposed. Ah, let it be exposed. In the name of Jesus, Josh 10, 16. Let every hidden snare for my feet be exposed. Jeremiah 18, 22, in the name of Jesus. I stand against and rebuke every wile of the devil. Ephesians 6, 10. I release myself from any snare of the devil. In the name of Jesus, 2 Timothy 2, 26. I will not come into the... Con- I will not come into... The condemnation of the devil, First Timothy three six. Lord, let no doctrine of the devil be established in my life. First Timothy four one. I nullify the power of any sacrifice made to devils in my city, region, or nation. In the name of Jesus, Le- Leviticus seventeen seven. I bind and rebuke. Malek and any spirit that has been assigned to abort my destiny. Leviticus 18.21 Give me strength. Oh Lord, give me strength to bring forth my destiny. Isaiah 66.9 I overcome every antichrist spirit because greater is he that is in me than he who is in the world. 1 John 4 verse 4 and 5 I loose myself from every spirit of error in the name of Jesus. 1 John 4 6 Lord, let me not operate in the wrong spirit. Luke 9, 55. I loose myself from every spirit of whoredom in the name of Jesus. Hosea 4, 12. Let me have and walk in an excellent spirit. Daniel 6, 3. I will take heed to my spirit at all times. Malachi 2, 15. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I bind and cast out any spirit that would try to tear down or tear apart my life in any manner in the name of Jesus Mark 9:20 Lord stir up my spirit to do your will Haggai 1:14 I bind and cast out any demon of slumber from my life in the name of Jesus Romans 11:8 I bind and cast out all demons of fear and timidity in the name of Jesus second Timothy 1 7 I bind and cast out all seducing spirits that would come 
my way in the name of Jesus, 1 Timothy 4, 1. I bind and rebuke the angel of light in the name of Jesus, 2 Corinthians eleven fourteen. I reject all false apostolic ministries in the name of Jesus, 2 Corinthians eleven thirteen. I reject all false prophet ministries in the name of Jesus, Matthew seven fifteen. I reject all false teaching ministries in the name of Jesus, 2 Peter 2, 1. Expose all false brethren to me, Lord, 2 Corinthians eleven twenty six. I reject the mouth of vanity and the right hand of falsehood. Psalms 144, 8. I reject every false vision and every false prof prophet word released into my life. Jeremiah 14, 14. I bind Satan, the deceiver, from releasing any deception into my life. Revelations 12, 9. I bind and cast out spirits of self-deception in the name of Jesus. 1 Corinthians 3.18 Hallelujah Shabbati Shigarabu Husugadi Balala Shadara Thank you Jesus Hallelujah Hallelujah Thank you Lord Thank you Lord Thank you Jesus Praise your name Praise your name Praise your name I bind and cast out any spirit of sorcery that would deceive me in the name of Jesus Let no man be deceived Matthew 24 4 Revelations 18 23 I bind and rebuke any bewitchment that would keep me from obeying the truth Galatians 3 1 I pray for utterance and boldness to make known the mystery of the gospel Ephesians 6 19 deliver me out of the hand of the wicked and unreasonable men 2nd Thessalonians 3 2 evil spirits leave my life as I hear and speak the word Matthew 8 16 I rebuke still and cast out the avenger hallelujah psalms 8 2 i bind and cast any creeping spirit that would attempt to creep into my life ezekiel 8 10 let the hammer of the wicked be broken jeremiah 50 23 i renounce all earthly sensual and demonic wisdom james 3 15 i cast out devils and i will be perfected luke 13 32 let every pharaoh that would pursue my life be drowned in the sea exodus 15 4 i rebuke every demonic bee that would surround me in the name of jesus psalms 118 12 i bind and cast out any spirit of absalom that would try to steal my heart from God's ordained leadership, Second Samuel fifteen six. I will sleep well. I will not be kept awake by any spirit of restlessness or insomnia. Psalms three five. Hallelujah. Shibbity he he. I laugh. I laugh at the enemy through the Holy Spirit. Psalm two four. I cut the cords of the wicked from my life. Psalms 129.4 Let every cord the enemy tries to put around my life be like burning flax. Judges 15.14 I break down every wall of Jericho. Joshua 6.5 Lord, cleanse my life from the secret faults. Psalms 19.12 Lord, let your secret be upon my tabernacle. Job 29.4 Lead me and guide me your way and your namesake for your namesake psalms 31 3 guide me continually isaiah 58 11 guide me into truth john 16 3 guide me with your eye psalms 32 8 guide me through my affairs and discretion psalms 112 5 guide me by the skillness the skillfulness of your hands, Psalm 78, 2, 72, 78, 72. Lead me in a pain, lead me in a plain path because of my enemies, Psalms 27, 11. Lead me not into temptation, but deliver me from evil, Matthew 6, 13. Lead me and make your way straight before my eyes, Psalms 58, excuse, Psalms 5, 8. Make the crooked places straight and the rough places smooth before me. Hallelujah. Isaiah 44. Send out your light and truth and lead them and let them lead me. Hallelujah. Psalms 43 3. Send out your light and truth and let them lead me. Hallelujah. Make darkness light before me and crooked things made straight isaiah 42 16 hallelujah touch me to do your will and lead me into the land of, of righteousness psalms 143 10 i put on the 
garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness, Isaiah 61, 3. Clothe me with a garment of salvation, Isaiah 61, 10. I put on my beautiful garments, Isaiah 52, 1. Let my garments always be white, Ecclesiastes 9, 8. Let me be clothed in with humanity, 1 Peter 5, 5. Cover me with a robe of righteousness, Isaiah 61, 10. Let my clothes be full of your virtue, Mark 5, 30. Let a mantle of power rest upon my life, 2 Kings 2, 8. Oh, Lord, give me wisdom in every area where I lack, James 1, 5. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord. Satan, the Lord rebuke you right now. Zechariah 3, 2, in the name of Jesus. Let the enemy perish at your rebuke, O Lord. Psalms 80, 16. Let the enemy flee at your rebuke, O Lord. Psalms 104, 7. I rebuke all the winds and the storms of the enemy against my life. In the name of Jesus, Mark 4, 39. Rebuke the company of the spearmen and the multitude of bulls until they submit. Psalm 68, 30. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke those that rush at me and let and let them flee away hallelujah isaiah 17 13 rebuke the devourer for my sake malachi 3 13 how yes lord rebuke the horse and the chariot and let them fall into a deep sleep psalm 76 6 i rebuke every unclean spirit that would attempt to operate in my life luke 9 42 i rebuke the the proud spirits that are curses hallelujah i rebuke the proud spirits that are cursed psalms 119 21 i release furious rebukes upon the enemy ezekiel 25 17 let the blast of your nostrils rebuke the enemy hallelujah second samuel 22 16 rebuke the enemy with flames of fire isaiah 66 hallelujah let the let a thousand flee at my tremble. <laughs> Let a thousand flee at my rebuke, O Lord. Isaiah 30, 17. Rebuke every spirit that would try to close upon my life. Psalms 106, 9. Devil, I rebuke you. Hold your peace and come out. Mark 1, 25. In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Shiba da saka, Lord. Keep my soul and deliver me. Psalms 25 20. Be pleased, O Lord, to deliver me. Psalms 40 13. Make haste, O Lord, and deliver me. Psalms 71. Deliver me in your righteousness. Psalms 71 2. Deliver me, O Lord, out of the hand of the enemy. Psalms 71 4. Deliver me from my persecutors. Um, Psalms 142 6. Deliver me out of the hand of great waters psalms 144 7 deliver me from the oppression of man psalms 119 134 hallelujah thank you lord thank you you're worthy to be praised thank you lord thank you jesus yes lord Feel your presence, Lord. Come into our presence right now, Lord. Come into our present presence right now, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. You're worthy to be praised. We magnify your name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. I am the head and not the tail. I have blessings flowing in and blessings flowing out. I am out of debt. All my needs are met. I have plenty more to put in store. I am blessed that I may be a blessing to others. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Glory, glory, glory. In the name of Jesus, I renounce 
all lust, perversion, immorality, uncleanliness, impurity, and sexual sin in the name of Jesus. I renounce all witchcraft, sorcery, divination, occult involvement in the name of Jesus. I renounce all ungodly soul ties and immoral relationships in the name of Jesus. I renounce all hatred, anger, resentment, revenge, retaliation, unforgiveness, and bitterness in the name of Jesus. I forgive any person who has ever hurt me, disappointed me, abandoned me, mistreated me, or rejected me in the name of Jesus. I renounce all addiction to drugs, alcohol, and any legal or illegal substance that has bound me in the name of Jesus. I renounce all pride, haughtiness, arrogance, vanity, ego, disobedience, and rebellion in the name of Jesus. I renounce all envy, jealousy, covetousness in the name of Jesus. I renounce all fear, unbelief, and doubt in the name of Jesus. I renounce all selfishness, self-will, self-pity, self-rejection, self-hatred, self-promotion in the name of Jesus. I renounce all ungodly thought patterns and belief systems in the name of Jesus. I renounce all ungodly covenants, oaths, and vows made by myself or my ancestors in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. I break all assignments of the enemy against my finances in the name of Jesus. I break all curses of poverty, lack, debt, and failure in the name of Jesus. I seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things are added to me. Matthew 6.33 I rebuke and cast out all spirits of the canker worm, palmer worm, caterpillar, and locusts that would eat up my blessings in the name of Jesus, Joel 2.25. Lord, teach me to profit and lead me in the way I should go, Isaiah 48.17. You are Jehovah Jireh, my provider, Genesis 22.14. You are El Shaddai the God of more than enough. Wealth and riches are in my house because I fear you and delight greatly in your commandments. Psalms 112, 1 through 3. The blessings of the Lord are upon my life and makes me rich. I am blessed coming in and blessed going out. I am God's servant and he takes pleasure in the prosperity of his saints. Psalms 35, 27. Jesus, you became poor, that through your poverty I might be rich. 2 Corinthians 8, 9 I meditate in the word day and night, and whatever I do prospers. Psalms 1, verse 3 Let peace be within my walls, and prosperity within my palace. Psalms 122, verse 7 I will prosper through the prophets and prophetic ministry, Ezra 6.14. I believe the prophets and I will prosper. I believe the prophets and I prosper. Second Chronicles 20.20. 20. I am your servant, Lord. Prosper me. Nehemiah 1.11. The God of heaven will prosper me. Nehemiah 2.20. I live in the prosperity of the king. Jeremiah 23.5. Through your favor, I will be a prosperous person. Genesis 39, verse 2. Lord, you have called me, and you make my way prosperous. Isaiah 48, 15. I pray in secret, and you reward me openly. Matthew 6, 6. I fast in secret, and you reward me openly. Matthew 6, 18. You reward me because I diligently seek you. Hebrews 11, 6. Lord, release the wealth of the wicked into my hands. Lord, bring me into a wealthy place. Psalm 66, 12. 
I give, and it is given to me, good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over. Luke 6.38 Open the floodgates of heaven over my life, and I receive more than enough room to receive. Malachi 3.10 Let every hole in my bag be closed in the name of Jesus. Haggai 1.6 Rebuke the devourer for my sake. Malachi 3.11 all nations will call me blessed, and I will be a delightful land. Malachi 3.12 My gates are open continually that the focus, wealth of the nations can come into my life. Isaiah 60.11 I am in league with the stones of the field. Job 5.23 Let your showers of blessing come upon my life. Ezekiel 34.26 Let my vats overflow. Joel 2.24 Let my barns be filled with plenty, and my presses burst with new wine. Proverb 3.10 Command your blessing upon my storehouse. Deuteronomy 28.8 Let my barns be full and overflowing. Let my sheep bring forth thousands and ten thousands. Let my oxen be strong to labor. Psalms 124.13 and 14 the plowman overtakes the reaper in my life, and the treader of grapes and the sower of the seed, and I live in a continual harvest. Amos 9.13 Let my floor be full of wheat, and my vats overflow with wine and oil. Joel 2.25 Deal wondrously with me, and let me eat and be satisfied. Joel 2.26 Make peace within my border and fill me with the finest of the wheat. Psalms 147.14 Let me be filled with honey and the finest of the wheat. Psalms 81.16 Lead me to a land flowing with milk and honey. Exodus 3.8 Bring me into a good land without scarceness and lack. Deuteronomy 8. Verse 9 Make all grace abound toward me that I will have sufficiency in all things and abound to every good work. 2 Corinthians 9, verse 8 Anoint my head with oil and let my cup runneth over. Psalms 23, 5 Let me have riches and honor in abundance. 2 Chronicles 18, 1 Let the rock pour me out rivers of oil. Job 29, 6 Let me dip my feet in oil. Deuteronomy 33, 24 let me see your heaps in my life. Second Chronicles 31 verse 8 I love wisdom, and I inherit substance, and my treasures are filled. Proverbs 8.21 I receive riches and honor, durable riches and righteousness. Proverbs 8 verse 18 Bring honey out of the rock for me. Psalm 81.16 Let me eat the finest of the wheat. Psalms 147.14 let my teeth be white with milk. Genesis 49.12 Wash my steps with butter. Job 29.6 Let me lay up gold as dust. Job 22.24 Let me have plenty of silver. Job 28.1 Let your river lead me to gold. Genesis 2, verse 11 and 12 Let me inherit the land. Psalm 37.29 I refuse to allow the angel of blessing to depart without blessing me. Genesis 2, verse 6. Oh, yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. You are a God that reveals secrets. Lord, reveal your secrets to me. Daniel 2, 28. Reveal to me the secret and deep things. Daniel 2, 22. Let me understand things kept in secret from the foundations of the world. Matthew 13, 35. Let the seals be broken from your word. Daniel 12, verse 9. Let me understand and have revelation of your will and purpose for my life. Give me the spirit of wisdom and revelation. And let the eyes of my understanding be enlightened. Ephesians 1, 17. Let me understand heavenly things. John 3.12 Open my eyes to behold wondrous things out of your word. Psalms 119 verse 18 
Let me know and understand the mysteries of the kingdom. Mark 4, 11. Let me speak to others by revelation. 1 Corinthians 14, 6. Reveal your secrets to your servants, the prophets. Amos 3, 7. Let the hidden things be manifest. Mark 4, 22. Hide your truths from the wise and prudent and reveal them to the babes. Matthew 11, 25. Let your arm be revealed in my life. John 12, 38. Reveal the things that belong to me. Deuteronomy 29, 29. Let your word be revealed to me. 1 Samuel 3, 7. Let your glory be revealed to me. Isaiah 40, verse 5. Let your righteousness be revealed in my life. Isaiah 56, 1. Let me receive visions and revelations of the Lord. 2 Corinthians 12, 1. Let me receive an abundance of revelations. 2 Corinthians 12, 7. Let me be a good steward of your revelations. 1 Corinthians 4, 1. Let me speak the mystery of Christ. Colossians 4, 3. Let me receive and understand your hidden wisdom. 1 Corinthians 2, 7. Hide not your commandments from me. Psalms 119, verse 19. Let me speak the wisdom of God in a mystery. 1 Corinthians 2, 7. Let me make known the mystery of the gospel. Ephesians 6, 19. Make known to me the mystery of your will. Ephesians 1, 9. Reveal to me the deep and secret things. Daniel 2, 22. Open your dark sayings upon the harp. Psalms 49, 4. Let me understand your parables, the words of the wise and their sayings. Let me understand your parables, the words of the wise and their dark sayings. Proverbs 1 6. Lord, lighten my candle and enlighten my darkness. Psalms 18 28. Make darkness light before me. Isaiah 42 16. Give me the Give me the treasures of darkness and hidden riches in secret places. Isaiah 45, 3. Let your candles shine upon my head. Job 29, 3. My spirit is the cradle of the Lord, searching all the inward parts of the belly. Proverbs 20, 27. Let me understand the deep things of God. 1 Corinthians 2, 10. Let me understand your deep thoughts. Psalms 92, 5. Let my eyes be enlightened to your word. Psalms 19.8 My eyes are blessed to see. Luke 10.23 Let all spiritual cataracts and scales be removed from my eyes. Acts 9.18 Let me comprehend with all saints what is the breadth, length, and depth, and height. Ephesians 3.18 let my reins instruct me in the night season, and let me awaken with revelation. Psalm 16, 7. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your healing. Thank you for your healing. Thank you. Thank you for your healing. Thank you for your healing. Thank you for your healing. I feel your healing power. I feel your presence all around me. Yes, Lord. I feel the blood of Jesus covering me from head to foot. I feel your healing power, healing every cell in my body, every dis-ease or disease being touched and healed right now. In the name of Jesus, thank you. Thank you. I see that part, this hurting, being healed right now. I can feel it. I see it in the spirit. Thank you, Jesus. I am healed by the stripes of Jesus, Isaiah 53, 5. Jesus carried my sickness and infirmities, Matthew 8, 17. I cast out all spirits of infirmity that would attack my body in the name of Jesus. I break, rebuke, and cast out the spirit of cancer that would attempt to establish itself in my lungs, bones, breast, throat, back, spine, liver, kidneys, pancreas, 
skin, or stomach in the name of Jesus. I rebuke and cast out all spirits causing diabetes, high blood pressure, low blood pressure, heart attack, stroke, kidney failure, leukemia, blood disease, breathing problems, arthritis, lupus, Alzheimer's, or insomnia in the name of Jesus. I speak healing and strength to my bones, muscles, joints, organs, head, eyes, throat, glands, blood, marrow, lungs, kidneys, liver, spleen, spine, pancreas, eyes, bladder, ears, nose, sinuses, mouth, tongue, and feet in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all heart attacks rooted in fear, and I command all spirits of fear to leave in the Jesus name, Luke 21, 26. I loose myself from all diabetes rooted in rejection, self-hatred, inheritance, and guilt, and command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all cancer rooted in bitterness, unforgiveness, resentment, and slander of the tongue. I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from lupus rooted in self-rejection, self-hatred, and guilt. And I cast these spirits out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all multiple sclerosis rooted in self-hatred, guilt, and rejection from the Father and cast these spirits out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from rheumatoid arthritis that is rooted in self-hatred and low self-esteem and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from high cholesterol that is rooted in anger and hostility and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I release myself from all sinus problems rooted in fear and anxiety and command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all high blood pressure rooted in fear and anxiety and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from asthma rooted in fear concerning relationships in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from a weakened immune system that is rooted in a broken spirit or broken heart and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all strokes rooted in self-rejection, self-bitterness, self-hatred and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. I loose myself from all bone diseases rooted in envy and jealousy and I command these spirits to come out now in the name of Jesus. Proverbs 14 verse 30. Forgive me, Lord, for allowing any fear, guilt, self-rejection, self-hatred, unforgiveness, bitterness, sin, pride, or rebellion to open the door to any sickness or infirmity. I renounce these things now in the name of Jesus. I cast out any spirit of infirmity that came into my life through pride in the name of Jesus. I cast out any spirit of infirmity that came into my life through trauma or accidents in the name of Jesus. I cast out all spirit of infirmity that came into my life through rejection in Jesus' name. I cast out any spirit of infirmity that came into my life through witchcraft now in the name of Jesus. Give me a sound heart which is the life of my flesh. Remove from my heart any evil or sinful attitude. Lord, remove any darts from my liver. Proverbs 7, 23. Heal and deliver me from all my pains right now. In the name of Jesus. I rebuke any sickness that will come out to eat up my flesh, including cancer in the name of Jesus. Psalms 27, 2. Let no diseases, things of Bilal, cleave to my body. Psalms 41, 8. I break all curses of disease and 
I break all curses of sickness and disease and command all hereditary spirits of sickness to come out now. In Jesus' name, Galatians 3.13. I break all curses of premature death and destruction in the name of Jesus. I prosper and walk in health even as my soul prospers. 3 John 1.2. In Jesus' name, I receive the word of God which is I receive the word of God, which is health to my flesh. Proverbs 4.22, in the name of Jesus. Lord, bless my bread and water and take sickness away from me. Exodus 23.25. I command every organ in my body to function the way God intended it to function. In the name of Jesus. Psalms 139.14. My bones are fat because I receive good report. My bones are fat because I received the good report. My bones are fat because I received the good report of the gospel. Proverbs 15, verse 30. Lord, keep all my bones. Psalms 34, 20. Let every tumor or evil growth melt right now at the presence of God. Psalm 97, 5. In Jesus' name. Let any infection in my body be burned by the fire of God in Jesus' name. I release myself from all allergies and sinus problems in the name of Jesus. I pray for my arteries and blood vessels to be opened and my circulatory system to function properly in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I rebuke all fevers in the name of Jesus, Luke 4, 39. My flesh shall be fresher than a child's, and I will return to the days of my youth, Job 33, 25. I pray for my immune system to be strengthened in the name of Jesus, Psalms 119, 28. Lord, renew my youth like the eagle, Psalms 103, 5. I will live and not die and proclaim the name of the Lord, Psalms 118, 17. My beauty shall be as the olive tree. Hosea 14.5 Lord, you heal all my diseases. Psalms 103.3 Lord, you are the health of my countenance. Psalms 43.5 Lord, you are the health of my countenance. Psalms 43.5 Heal me, Lord, and I shall be healed. Jeremiah 17.14 Let your virtue touch my life and heal me. Luke 6.19 I release the fire of God to burn out any sickness or disease that would operate in my body right now in the name of Jesus. No sickness or plague will come near my dwelling, Psalms 91.10. Jesus, arise over my life with healing in your wings, Malachi 4.2. The Lord is the strength of my life. Psalms 27, 1. I command every germ or sickness that touches my body to die in Jesus' name. I command every germ or sickness that touches my body to die right now in the name of Jesus. I take the shield of faith and quench every fiery dart from the enemy right now in Jesus' name. Ephesians 6, 16. I read I am redeemed from sickness and disease. Galatians 3.13 in the name of Jesus. I bind and cast out all spirits of hatred, resentment, violence, murder, unforgiveness, anger, and retaliation in the name of Jesus. I bind and cast out. I bind and cast out spirits of paranoia, distrust, persecution, confrontation, and fear in the name of Jesus. Glory to his name. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you for filling me. Thank you for healing me. Thank you for my breakthrough. Thank you for your provision. Thank you for everything you've done for me. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. 
I am redeemed from the curse through the blood of Jesus, Galatians 3.13. I am the seed of Abraham and his blessings are mine, Galatians 3.14. Galatians 3.14. I choose blessings instead of cursing and life instead of death, Deuteronomy 11.26. I break and release myself from all generational curses and iniquities as a result of the sins of my ancestors in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses on both sides of my family back 60 generations. I break all curses of witchcraft, sorcery, and divination right now in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of pride and rebellion right now in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of death and destruction right now in the name of Jesus. I break and rebuke all curses of sickness and infirmity in my body right now in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I break and release myself from all curses of poverty, lack, and debt in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of rejection in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all the curses of double-mindedness and schizophrenia in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of Jezebel and Ahab in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of divorce and separation in the name of Jesus. I I break and release myself from all curses of lust and perversion in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of confusion and mental illness in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of idolatry in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses causing accidents and premature death in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all curses of wandering and vagabond in the name of Jesus. I break and release myself from all spoken curses and negative words spoken against me by others and by those in authority, and I bless them. I break and release myself from all self-inflicted curses by negative words I have spoken in the name of Jesus. I command every demon hiding and operating behind a curse to come out right now in the name of Jesus. I pray for the gateway cities in my nation to become gateways of righteousness and not iniquity. I pray for the gateway cities in my nation to become gateways of righteousness and not iniquity. Lord, raise up Bethel churches that will be the gate of heaven. Genesis twenty-eight seventeen. Lord, raise up apostolic gate churches that will usher presence and revelation into my region. And right now, Lord, let any idol in my life or nation be destroyed and burned within your fire, 1 Kings 5.13. Lord, cut down all idols in the land, Second Chronicles 34.7. Let the familiar spirits Wizards and idols be taken out of the land, Second Kings 23, verse 24. Let the idols be confounded and the images be broken in pieces, Jeremiah 52, 50, verse 2. Let men throw away their idols and turn to you, O Lord, Isaiah 31, 7. I renounce all idolatry in my bloodline and break all curses of idolatry in the name of Jesus. 2 Kings 21, verse 21. Lord, put the names of the idols out of the land. Zechariah 13, 2. I will keep myself from idols. 1 John 5, 21. Abolish the idols in America and the nations. Isaiah 2, 18. Lord, expose all idols as lying vanities. Zechariah 10, 2. I renounce all covetousness. And I will not serve the God of Mammon. Colossians 3, 5. Let Babylon, the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth, fall in the name of Jesus. Revelation 17, 5. Lord, cleanse the pollution of idols from the land. Acts 15, 20. Sprinkle clean water upon me and cleanse me from all the filthiness and cleanse me from all idols. Ezekiel 36, 25. Let me not go astray 
after any idol. Ezekiel 44.10 Let all false gods and idols, including humans, be removed from my life in the name of Jesus. I will put no other gods before you, Lord. Exodus 20, verse 3. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Break off my life any limitations and restrictions placed on my life by any evil spirits in the name of Jesus. I bind and cast out all python and constrictor spirits in the name of Jesus. And bless me indeed, enlarge my coast. Let your hand be with me and keep me from evil. First Chronicles 4.10 Cast out my enemies and enlarge my borders. Exodus 34, 24. Lord, you have promised to enlarge my borders. Deuteronomy 12, 20. Enlarge my heart so I can run the way of your commandments. Psalms 119, 32. My mouth is enlarged over my enemies. 1 Samuel 2, 1. Enlarge my steps so I can conceive your wealth and prosperity. Isaiah 60, verse 5. Through nine, Shabakadi. Shabakadi. I receive deliverance and enlargement for my life. Esther four fourteen. The Lord shall increase me more and more, me and my children. Psalms one fifteen verse fourteen. Let your kingdom and government increase my life. Isaiah nine seven. Let me increase in the knowledge of God. Colossians two. Colossians two nineteen. O Lord, bless me and increase me. Isaiah 51 2. Let me increase exceedingly. Genesis 30 43. Let me increase with the increase of God. Colossians 2 19. Let me increase and abound in love. 1 Thessalonians 3 12. Increase my greatness and comfort me on every side. Psalm 71 21. Let me increase in wisdom and stature. Luke 2 52. Let me increase in strength and confound the adversaries. Acts 9.22 Let your grace and favor increase in my life. Let, your, let the years of my life be increased. Proverbs 9.11 Let the word of God increase in my life. Acts 6.7 Bless me in all my increase. Deuteronomy 14.22 Let my giving increase. Let my giving and tithes increase. Deuteronomy 14.22 Let my latter end greatly increase. Job 8.7 Let me grow in grace and in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. 2 Peter 3.18 I will flourish like a palm tree and grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Psalms 92.12 Let my faith grow exceedingly. 2 Thessalonians 1.3 the breaker is gone up before me and broken through every limitation and barrier of the enemy. Micah 2.13 Lord, you are the God of the breakthrough. You have broken forth against my enemies. 2 Samuel 5.20 My branches run over every wall erected by the enemy. Genesis 49.22 I can run through a troop and leap over a wall. Let my line go through all the earth and my words to the end of the world. Psalm 19.4 I am a joint heir with Jesus Christ, even for my inheritance, and the uttermost part of the earth for my possession. Psalm 2.18 Right now, I speak to every mountain in my life, and command it to be removed and cast into the sea. Mark 11.23 In Jesus' name. The mountains tremble at the presence of God. Habakkuk 3.10 I command every mountain and command them to hear my voice. Micah 6.1 in the name of Jesus. Lay the mountain of Esau, the flesh, to waste. Malachi 1.3 in Jesus' name. Put forth your hand, O Lord, and overturn the mountains by their roots. Job 28.9 in the name of Jesus. No one has an arm like you, O Lord full of power and might. Job 40, verse 9. Lord, you have a mighty arm. Your hand is strong. Your right hand is high. Psalms 89, 13. Stretch out your arm and deliver me and rid me 
out of all bondage. Exodus 6, 6, in the name of Jesus. Let fear and dread fall upon the enemy by the greatness of your arm until I pass over. Exodus 15, verse 16, in the name of Jesus. Psalms 44, 3. Break Rahab in pieces and scatter your enemies with your strong arm. Psalm 89, 10. Let your hand establish me and let your arm strengthen me. Psalm 89.21 Your right hand and your holy arm gives me victory. Psalm 98.1 In Jesus' name. Show lightning. Show lightning down your arm against my enemies. Isaiah 30.30 30, In the name of Jesus. I trust in your arm for my salvation. Isaiah 51 verse 5 Awake. Awake and put on strength, O arm of the Lord. Awake, as in the ancient days, cut Rahab and wound the dragon, Isaiah 51, 9. Make bare your holy arm in the sight of all nations and let all flesh see your salvation, Isaiah 52, 10. Show strength with your arm and scatter the ground, Luke 1, 51. Reveal your arm unto me that I might know your strength, and power. Let the power in your hands be released into my life. Habakkuk 3 verse 4 in the name of Jesus. And Lord, right now, I cover myself, my family, and my possessions with the blood of Jesus. Let the fire of God surround and protect my life from all destruction. Let the angel of God encamp around me and protect me, Psalms 34, 7, in the name of Jesus. Let your glory be my covering and protect my back in the name of Jesus. Hold me up and I will be safe, Psalm 119, 117, in the name of Jesus. The name of Jesus is a strong tower. I run into it and I am safe, Proverb 18, 10. Lord, you make me to dwell in safety, Psalm 4, 8. Set me in safety from all them that puff at me, Psalm 12, 5. Let me dwell in my land safely, Leviticus 2, Leviticus 26, 5. Lead me safely, and I will not fear. Let the sea overwhelm my enemies, Psalm 78, 53. Let me lie down and rest in safety, Job 11, 18, Isaiah 14, 30. I will dwell in safety and nothing shall make me afraid. Ezekiel 34, 28. Keep me as the apple of your eye and hide me under the shadow of your wing. Psalm 17, 8. I will trust in the covert of your wings. Psalm 61, 4. In the shadow of your wings will I trust. Psalm 57, 1. Be my covert from the storm and the rain, Isaiah 4, 6. Be my covered from the wind and the tempest, Isaiah 32, 2. Cover my head in the day of battle, Psalm 147. Cover me with the shadow of your hand, Isaiah 51, 16. Cover me with your feathers, Psalm 91, 4. Be my defense and refuge, Psalm 59, 16. Defend and deliver me, Isaiah 31, 5, in Jesus' name. Let your glory be my defense, Isaiah 4, 5, in the name of Jesus. Defend me from all those that rise up against me, Psalm 59, 1, in the name of Jesus. Lord, you are my shield and my hiding place, Psalms 119, 114, in the name of Jesus. Lord, surround me with your shield of protection, Psalm 5, 12, in the name of Jesus. Bring them down, O Lord, my shield, Psalm 59, 11. Let your truth be my shield, Psalm 91, 4. Lord, you are my shield and exceeding great reward, Genesis 15, 1. I will not be afraid of 10,000 that have set themselves against me because you are a shield for me, Psalm 3, 1 through 6. You are a strong tower from the enemy, Psalm 61, verse 3. And Lord, release your glorious power against the enemy, Exodus 15, 6. Let the power and the might be released from your hand, First Chronicles 29, 12. 
Scatter the enemy by your power. Psalm 59:11. Rule over your enemies through your power. Psalm 66:7. And let the power of your anger be released against the powers of darkness. Psalms 90 verse 11. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Halabakahishi. Thank you. Ah, Sabakahishi. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I stand in agreement with every person listening to this prayer right now for every prayer request that is going up right now to be placed in your hands O Lord right now to cast all our care on you Lord right now you did not create a spirit of fear but love power and a sound mind we cast all our care on you O Lord for you care for us you shall supply all our need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus and now to him who is able to do exceedingly and abundantly above all that we can ask or think according to the power that works in us and Lord say call upon me and I will answer you and show you great and mighty things which you do not know Lord we call upon you right now we've given it to you right now Lord We've given you every fear. We've given you every dis-ease, every disease, every worry, every care, everything that's bothering us, every challenge, everything. Lord, we're giving you every single conflict, challenge, and anything whatsoever that is coming against us negatively. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we're giving it to you right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ah, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And right now. Ah, yes, Lord. Right now, I call out and I bind every negative spirit within the sound of my voice. I bind every negative spirit, disease, destruction, negativity, depression, cancer, anxiety, fear, self-destruction. In every other negative spirit, named or unnamed, I call you out now and cast you away from the presence of every person listening to this video and this tape right now and myself. I cast you away from all of us right now in the name of Jesus into the abyss. And I loose into the lives of everyone listening as well as myself. I loose the loving spirits of love, harmony, happiness, peace of mind, prosperity, protection, empowerment, and every other positive spirit, named or unnamed whatsoever in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I decree and declare in the name of Jesus that everything lifted, bound, cast out in parts one or two of binding and loosing in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare that they shall all come to pass in Jesus' name. And we claim the victory right now. We claim the victory in advance, Lord, for our victory over whatever our situation is, Lord. We claim our victory right now in the name of Jesus. And we thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Oh, we thank you, Lord. 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 Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Hallelujah. Praise Him. Praise Him. Hallelujah. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy, Lord. You're worthy, Lord. You're worthy, Lord. You're worthy, Lord. You're worthy to be praised. You're worthy to be praised. You're worthy to be praised. You're worthy. 
worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory, Lord. Praise Him. 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 Oh, thank you, Jesus. I leave nothing, nothing, Lord. I leave nothing in me, Lord. I've given everything. Everything to you, Lord. Everything. I hold on to nothing. I'm holding on to nothing that's bothering me, Lord. I'm giving everything to you. I give it all to you, Lord. I give it all to you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, yes, Lord. I've given it away. Ah, I feel your peace. I feel your peace, Lord. I feel your peace. Ah, oh, yes, Lord. No stress. No anxiety. I feel your peace. I feel your peace. Oh, I love you. Thank you. Thank you for my victory. Thank you. Thank you for my healing. Thank you. Thank you for my breakthrough. Thank you. Thank you for my provision. Thank you. Thank you for my supernatural miracle that came into my life. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your everlasting love. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I feel your presence. I feel your presence and I say thank you I can't thank you enough Lord I can't thank you enough Lord but I do thank you Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Praise your name. Thank you for that peace beyond understanding. Yes, Lord. I want to know you more, Lord. Come into my heart even more, Lord. I submit myself to you, Lord. Use me. Use me, Lord. Use me. Use me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shabaka Kalamakadesi Shabana Sada. Kalamakadesi Sikaraba Shakarabana Sakada. Thank you, Jesus. Praise Him. Praise Him. We worship you, Lord. We worship you. We worship you, Lord. We worship you. We glorify you. We magnify you. Yes, Lord. Sabakadesha. And when the end of this tape, please, you don't have to stop when I stop. If you wish to seek to continue to bask in his presence, either just continue in silence or actually play basking in his presence or any of the other 
songs that keep you in this state. But right now, we're feeling the presence of the Lord all around us. Feel Him. Feel His presence. Remember what this feels like so that you can recapture that. You know what you're going for each time you get to prayer and you pray. You want to feel this feeling of presence all around you. So you must not rush and take your time to come before the presence of the Lord. All these things we ask, Lord, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Psalms 1, 1 through 6. Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor stands in the path of sinners, nor sits in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law he meditates day and night. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that brings forth its fruit in its season, whose leaf also shall not wither and whatever he does shall prosper. Psalms 3 and 3 You, O Lord, are a shield for me, my glory, and the one who lifts up my head. Psalms 7, verse 9 and 10 O let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end, but establish the just. For the righteous God tests the hearts and minds. My defense is of God, who saves the upright. Psalms 10, 14 and 15. But you have seen, for you observe trouble and grief, to repay it by your hand. The helpless commits himself to you, O Lord. You are the helper of the fatherless. Break the arm of the wicked and evil man. Seek out his wickedness until you find none. Psalms 11, 3 through 7. The Lord is in his holy temple. The Lord's throne is in heaven. 
His eyes behold, his eyelids test sons of men. The Lord tests the righteous, but the wicked and the one who loves violence his soul hates. Upon the wicked he will rain coals, fire, and brimstone, and burning wind should be the portion of their cup. For the Lord is righteous, he loves righteousness, his countenance beholds the upright. Psalms 18, 18, 28-32 For you will light my lamp. The Lord my God will enlighten my darkness. For by you I can run against a troop. By my God I can leap over a wall. As for God, his way is perfect. The word of the Lord is proven. He is a shield for all those who trust in him. For who is God? except the Lord and who is a rock except our God it is God who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect Psalms 18 47 and 48 it is God who avenges me and subdues the people under me he delivers me from my enemies you also lift me up above those who rise up against me you have delivered me from the violent man Psalms 37, 1 through 24. Don't be worried on the account of the wicked. Don't be jealous of those who do wrong. They will soon disappear like grass that dries up, and they will die like the plants that wither. Trust in the Lord and do good. Live in the land and be safe. Seek your happiness in the Lord, and he will give you your heart's desire. Give yourself to the Lord. Trust in him and he will help you. He will make your righteousness shine like the noonday sun. Be patient and wait for the Lord to act. Don't be worried about those who prosper or those who succeed in their evil plans. Don't give in to worry or anger. It only leads to trouble. Those who trust in the Lord will possess the land, but the wicked will be driven out. Soon the wicked will disappear. You may look for them, but you won't find them. But the humble will possess the land and enjoy prosperity and peace. The wicked man plots against the good man and glares at him with hate. But the Lord laughs at the wicked man because he knows they will soon be destroyed. The wicked draw their swords and bend their bows to kill the poor and needy to slaughter those who do what is right but they will be killed by their own swords and their bows will be smashed the little that a good man owns is worth more than the wealth of all the wicked because the Lord will take away the strength of the wicked but protect those who are good the Lord takes care of those who obey him and the land will be theirs forever they will not suffer when time of famine but the wicked will die the enemies of the Lord will vanish like wild flowers they will disappear like smoke the wicked man borrows and never pays back but the good man is generous with his gifts those who are blessed by the Lord will possess the land but those who are cursed by him will be driven out the Lord guides a man in the way he should go and protects those who please him. If they fall, they will not stay down, because the Lord will help them up. Turn away from evil and do good, and your descendants will always live in the land. For the Lord loves what is right, and does not abandon his faithful people. The righteous will possess the land, and live in it forever. A good man's words are wise, and he is always fair. He keeps the law of his God in his heart and never departs from it. A wicked man watches a good man and tries to kill him, but the Lord will not abandon him to his enemy's power or let him be condemned when he is on trial. Put your hope in the Lord and obey his commandments. He will honor you by giving you the land, and you will see the wicked driven out. The Lord saves the righteous men and protects them in times of trouble. 
He helps them and rescues them. He saves them from the wicked because they go to him for protection. Psalms 56.10 Whenever I'm afraid, I will trust in you, Lord. In God, I will praise his word. In God, I have put my trust. I will not fear. What can flesh do to me? All day they twist my words. All their thoughts are against me for evil. They gather together. They hide. They mark my steps. When they lie in wait for my life, shall they escape by iniquity? In anger, cast down the people, O God. You number my wanderings. Put my tears in your bottle. Are they not in your book? When I cry out to you, then my enemies will turn back. This I know, because God is for me. God, I will praise his word. In the Lord, I will praise his word. In God, I have put my trust. I will not be afraid. What can man do to me? Psalms 59, 1, 2, and 10. Deliver me from my enemies, O my God. Defend me from those who rise up against me. Deliver me from the workers of iniquity and save me from bloodthirsty men. My God of mercy shall come to meet me. God shall let me see my desire on my enemies. Psalm 64, 2 through 10. Hide me from the secret plots of the wicked, from the rebellion of the workers of iniquity, who sharpen their tongues like a sword and bend their bows to shoot their arrows, bitter words that they may shoot in secret of the blameless. Suddenly they shoot at him and do not fear. They encourage themselves in an evil manner. They talk of laying snares secretly. They say, who will see this? Who will see them? They devise iniquities. They have perfected a shrewd scheme. Both the inward thought and the heart of a man are deep. But God shall shoot at them with an arrow. Suddenly they shall be wounded. So he will make them stumble over their own tongue. All who see them shall flee away. All men shall fear and shall declare the work of God. For they shall wisely consider his doing. Psalm 71, 4 and 5. Deliver me, O my God, out of the hand of the wicked out of the hand of the unrighteous and cruel man for you are my hope O Lord God you are my trust from my youth by you I have been upheld from birth you are he who took me out of my mother's womb my praise shall continually be of you O God do not be far from me O God make haste to help me let them be confounded and consumed who are adversaries of my life let them be covered with reproach and dishonor who seek my hurt but I will hope continually and will praise you yet more and more Psalms 121 1 through 8 I will lift up my eyes to the hills from whence my help comes my help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth he will not allow your foot to be moved he who keeps you will not slumber nor sleep the Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day or the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve you from all evil. He shall preserve your soul. The Lord shall preserve your going out and your coming in from this time forth and forevermore. Psalms 140, 1 through 13. Deliver me from evil. Preserve me from the violent men who plan all evil things in their heart. They continually gather together for war. They sharpen their tongues like a serpent. The poison of ass is under their lips. Keep me, O Lord, from the hands of the wicked. Preserve me from the violent man who have purposed to make my steps stumble. The proud have hidden a snare for me and cords. They have spread a net by the wayside. They have set traps for me. I said to the Lord, You are my God. Hear the voice of my supplications, O Lord. O God, the Lord, the strength of my salvation, you have covered my head in the day of battle. Do not grant, O Lord, the desires of the wicked. Do not further 
his wicked scheme, lest they be exalted. As for the head of those who surround me, let the evil of their lips cover them. Let burning coals fall upon them. Let them be cast into the fire, into deep pits, that they rise not up again. Let not a slanderer be established in the earth. Let the evil hunt the violent man to overthrow him. I know that the Lord will maintain the cause of the afflicted and justice for the poor. Surely the righteous shall give thanks to your name. The upright shall dwell in your presence. Psalms 141, 6, 9, and 10. For still my prayer is against the deeds of the wicked. The judges are overthrown by the sides of the cliff, and they hear my words, for they are sweet. Keep them from the snares that they have laid for me, and from the traps of the workers of iniquity. Let the wicked fall into their own nets, while I escape safely. The Lord is righteous in all his ways, gracious in all his works. The Lord is near to all who call upon him, to all who call upon him in truth. He will fulfill the desires of those who fear him. He will also hear the cry and save them. The Lord preserves all who love him, but all the wicked he will destroy. My mouth shall speak the praise of the Lord, and all flesh shall bless his holy name forever and ever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me down the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen.
Thank you.
Thank you.
goodness and your mercy, Lord. We just say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for waking us up this morning. Thank you for protecting us each and every day at times when we didn't even know we needed protecting. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you for victory over every situation we're dealing with this day. We thank you for that victory in the name of Jesus. We know we have victory because we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. And we say thank you. Thank you. We hold on to your promises, Lord. For we know that is the key to our healing in every situation. Healing our mind, healing our body, healing our spirit. Psalms 118, 24. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be exceedingly glad in it. Mark 4 and 4. Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Matthew 6.33 Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. Jeremiah 33 and 3 You said, Call upon me, and I will answer you, and show you great and mighty things which you do not know. Psalms 91, 1 through 12. He who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, You are my refuge and my fortress. My God in you I will trust. Surely you will deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. You shall cover me with your feathers and under your wings I shall take refuge. Your truth shall be my shield and buckler. I shall not be afraid of the terror by night nor the destruction that lays waste at noonday. A thousand may fall at my side, ten thousand at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. Only with my eyes shall I look and see the reward of the wicked. Because I have made the Lord who is my refuge, even the Most High, my dwelling place, no evil shall befall me, nor shall any plague come near my dwelling. For you shall give your angels charge over me to keep me in all my ways. In their hands they shall bear me up. Proverbs 3 verse 5 and 6 says, I will trust in you, Lord, with all my heart and lean not to my own understanding. In all my ways I acknowledge you, Lord, and know that you will direct my path. Philippians 4.19 For you, O Lord, shall supply all my need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. 2 Corinthians 4.18 For I look not at the things that are seen, but at the things that are not seen. For things that are seen are temporary, while things that are not seen are eternal. 
Isaiah 53 verse 5 says, By your stripes I am healed. 2 Corinthians 5 and 7, For I walk by faith, not by sight. Hebrews 11 6, For without faith it is impossible to please you. For those who come to you must believe that you are and that you are a rewarder to those who diligently seek you. 1 Peter 5, 7 I cast all my care upon you, for you care for me. Philippians 4, 13 I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Luke 10, 19 Behold, you have given me authority to trample over all the power of the enemy and nothing I said nothing shall by any means hurt me 2 Timothy 4 18 and you O Lord will deliver me from every evil work and preserve me for your heavenly kingdom Psalms 37 and 4 Delight in you, O Lord, and you will give me the desires of my heart. Psalms 37, 34 Wait on you and keep your ways, and you will exalt me to inherit the land. John 15 If I abide in you and your words abide in me, then I shall ask what I desire and it shall be done for me. Mark eleven twenty four. Whatever things I desire when I pray, I believe, I receive them, and I shall have them. 1 John 5, 14 and 15. Now this is the confidence that I have in you, O Lord, that if I ask anything, according to your will you hear me and if I know that you hear me whatever I ask I know I have the petitions that I have asked of you 1 Thessalonians 5 16 through 18 I rejoice always pray without ceasing in everything give thanks for this is your will for me. Psalms 23 The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the path of righteousness for his namesake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me, thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Thank you, Lord. We hold on to these promises, Lord. 
we hold on to your word. For we know there is victory in your word. And we say thank you. Thank you, Lord, for your healing power. We feel your presence. And we say thank you. We just bask in your presence, Lord. We bask in this healing power. We feel the relaxation entering our body, starting at our feet. The relaxation slowly moves up to the ankles. From the ankles into the lower leg. The lower leg to the upper legs. Into the hips. Up to the waist. Waist down. You are completely relaxed. Keep your deep breathing going during this part. Inhale. Exhale. Feel the relaxation. The relaxation continues up through from the stomach up into the chest area up to the shoulders. Down both arms. Focus on that relaxation. Relaxation moves into your neck, up into your head and face muscles. Your face is completely relaxed. And you can feel the relaxation energy just continuing out the top of your head. If any part of your body is tense at this moment, Focus on that area and tell it to relax. You're in control. Keep the deep breathing going and focus on complete relaxation. And as you're completely relaxing, you're not trying to go to sleep. You're trying to just submit completely to the Lord. If you're focusing on praise and worship, just praise His name. Thank you, Lord. Because when you start praising, it's hard to fall asleep because the Spirit is wide awake, communing with the Lord. Ah, yes, Lord. We love you, Lord. Praise your name, O oh Lord. Ah, Sakapadishki. Ah, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. However the Spirit moves you, if you move to speak in tongues, pray in tongues, don't worry about the sound of imitation. Whatever sound comes out your mouth from praise and from worship, just let it flow. Focus completely on talking to the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I submit to you, Lord. I lift up to you every challenge, every problem, every financial concern, every dis-ease, every disease, everything in my life, Lord. I lift it up to you. And if there is anything that is not in your will, Lord. Remove it now in the name of Jesus. Dis-ease be gone in the name of Jesus. Disease, the blood of Jesus is covering you right now with God's healing power. Whatever area is not feeling well, blood of Jesus covers it right now in the name of Jesus and feel the healing taking place in the name of Jesus we receive your healing power Lord we receive it Lord receive it we 
receive it. God is healing everything right now. And speak it with me. God is healing everything now. God is healing everything now. Yes, Lord. Oh, I say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Stress is gone in the name of Jesus. Anxiety is gone in the name of Jesus. Fear is gone in the name of Jesus. Depression is gone now in the name of Jesus. Worry in the name of Jesus. Violent thoughts in the name of Jesus be gone. We bind any demonic attack right now in the name of Jesus that is trying to attack those who are listening and spending this time with God right now. We bind you in the name of Jesus and we loose you from attacking these saints in any way. We loose you from your assignment of attacking them, their loved ones, their family members, and anyone else named or unnamed in the mighty name of Jesus. And the blood of Jesus covers them right now, covers their loved ones right now, covers those named or unnamed who are close to them right now in the name of Jesus. Attacks be gone in the name of Jesus. And let the peace beyond understanding fill your spirit. Yes, Lord. And just say thank you, Lord. Thank you. Ah, Sagabaka Dika Shik Dika La Sabada. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Got a Sasha got the back. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Shalabaka Dissi Shasa. Hallelujah. Praise your name, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. I say thank you in advance, Lord. Thank you in advance. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Praise your name. Praise your name, Lord. And Father, in the name of Jesus, I bind the wills of every person known and unknown to the will and mind of Christ. I bind your body soul and spirit to the mind emotion purposes and will of God for our lives I bind your mind will emotions to the will of God I bind us to the truth and the blood of Jesus I bind our minds to the mind of Christ that the very thoughts feeling and purposes of his heart would be within our thoughts. I bind our feet to the paths of righteousness that their steps would be steady and sure. I bind each of us to God's timing in our lives. I bind us to the work of the cross with all its mercy, grace, love, forgiveness, and dying to self. And I loose every old, wrong, ungodly pattern of thinking, attitude, desire, idea, belief, motivation, habit, and behavior from us right now in the name of Jesus. I tear down, crush, smash, and destroy every stronghold associated with these things in the name of Jesus. I loose any stronghold in our lives that has been justifying and protecting hard feelings against anyone. I loose the strongholds of unforgiveness, fear, and distrust from us. I loose the power and effects of deception and lies from us. I loose confusion and blindness of the God of this world 
from our mind that has kept us from seeing the light of the gospel of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus. I call forth every precious word of scripture that has ever entered into our mind and heart that it would rise up in power within us. In the name of Jesus, I loose the power and effects of any harsh or hard words, word curses spoken to, about, or by us. I loose all generational bondages and associated strongholds from us. I loose all effects and bondages and associated strongholds from us that may have been caused by mistakes we have made. And Father, in the name of Jesus, I crush, smash, destroy generational bondages of any kind from mistakes made at any point between generations. I destroy them right here, right now. They will not bind and curse any more members of these families. I bind the strong man Satan that we may spoil his house, taking back sevenfold every material and spiritual possession he has wrongfully taken from us. I loose the enemy's influence over every part of our body, soul, and spirit in the name of Jesus. I loose, crush, smash, and destroy every evil device he may try to bring into our spirits of influence during this day. I loose all negative influences of the world from us today. I crush and smash all the deceptions the enemy may try to use to confuse us. I tear down, apart, crush, smash and rip asunder the effects of the enemy in every area of our lives, finances, families, homes, work and businesses in the name of Jesus. I bind and loose these people in Jesus' name. Everyone listening right now, God has given us the keys and the authority to do so. We can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. In the name of Jesus, amen and amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for freeing our minds. Thank you for freeing our hearts. Any distractions are gone right now. In the name of Jesus. any deceitful lies being planted in our spirit during this time, we cast them out in the name of Jesus. This is our time with the Lord and the devil shall not touch it in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, praise your name. We feel your presence, Lord. We feel your presence. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. For Lord, we know you are Yahweh, the Lord. El Elyon, the Most High. El Shaddai, the Almighty. Elohim, the Sublime God. Adonai, my Lord and Master. Jehovah Jireh, my provider, Jehovah Rapha, my healer, Jehovah Imkedesh, my sanctifier, Jehovah Nisi, my victory, my banner, Jehovah Shalom, my peace, Jehovah Tisitkanu, my righteousness, Jehovah Rohai, my shepherd, and Jehovah Shama, my helper. We believe you are all these things, Lord, because you said, I am.
that I am. That means you are whatever we need you to be. And we believe you, Lord. We hold on to your promises as we bask in your presence. Thank you. We feel your healing. Healing power is all around us. Healing every cell in our body. The blood of Jesus covers us from head to foot. The blood of Jesus is healing and touching every cell in our body. In the name of Jesus. We feel the rejuvenation of energy in mind, body, and spirit. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, Kalaman Sikada Shalabaka Sakatata. Hola Pakatata Shakata Kifa. We love you, Lord. We love you, Lord. Meela Pada Sagati Hijni. You're worthy. You're so worthy, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Psalm 6 and 2 says, Have mercy on me, Lord. O Lord, for I am weak. O Lord, heal me, for my bones are troubled. Psalms 103, verses 1 to 3. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your iniquities, and who heals all your diseases. Exodus 23, verse 25, And so you shall serve the Lord your God, and he will bless your bread and your water. And I will take sickness away from the midst of you. Exodus 15, 26. If you diligently heed the voice of the Lord your God and do what is right in his sight, give ear to his commandments and keep all his statutes. I will put none of the diseases on you which I have brought on the Egyptians for I am the Lord who heals you. James 5 verse 16 Confess your trespasses to one another and pray for one another that you may be healed. The effective fervent prayer of a righteous man avails much. Proverbs 3, 7 and 8 Do not be wise in your own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from evil. It will be health to your flesh and strength to your bones. Malachi 4 and 2 But to you who fear my name, the Son of Righteousness shall arise with healing in his wings. Isaiah 53, 5 He was wounded for our transgressions, bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement for our peace was upon him, and by his stripes we are healed. Isaiah 58 and 8 then your light shall break forth like the morning. Your healing shall spring forth steadily and speedily. And your righteousness shall go before you. The glory of the Lord shall be your rear guard. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. Praise your mighty name. Yes, Lord. Healing confession. The gospel that I have heard. 
is the power of God into salvation. I confess Jesus Christ as Lord over my life, spirit, soul, and body. I receive the power of God to make me sound, whole, delivered, saved, and healed right now. I act on the Word of God and I receive the power of God. Sickness, disease, pain, I resist you right now in the name of Jesus. You are not the will of God. I enforce the Word of God on you. I will not tolerate you in my life. Leave my presence right now in the name of Jesus. I will never allow you back. My days of sickness and disease are over. I am the healed protecting my health. I am saved. The power of sickness has been forever broken over my life. Jesus bore my sickness, my weakness, and pain, and I am forever free. Sickness shall no longer lord it over me. Sin shall no longer lord it over me. Fear shall no longer lord it over me. Satan shall no longer lord it over me. I have a covenant of peace and it shall not be removed in the name of Jesus. I have been redeemed from the curse of the law. I proclaim my freedom in the name of Jesus. Today the gospel is the power of God unto me. Under salvation, I receive the gospel. I act on the gospel and I am made whole in Jesus name. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. I am the redeemed of the Lord. I have said it and it is so in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, it is your will for me to walk in healing, for me to walk in divine health. I know the truth. I have heard the word. Faith has come. And I have faith in healing. I know some things now. Now in the name of Jesus, I release my faith now. And I declare right now, I will not turn loose what's mine. Healing is mine. I am an heir of healing. I have a right to it and Jesus has given it to me. And in Jesus name, I will not give away what he has given to me. And now I declare boldly before all of heaven that I do not plan for one minute to give up, to cave in, and to quit. But I do plan to receive everything that has been promised in the Word of God. I declare healing in my life, healing in my body, healing in my mind. I boldly say, I am healed. I am healed. I am healed in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Continue to repeat, I am healed. Relationships are healed. Worries are healed. Any ulcers or tensions are healed. A restless mind is healed. Depression healed. 
fear healed. Anger healed. Unforgiveness healed. And any other negative emotion, negative thoughts, or expectations, we cast them out right now and heal the mind that has been running from those negative thoughts. The love of God covers us. The blood of Jesus covers us. Our mind and soul and spirit are one with the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you for my healing. Thank you. And whatever specifically you're praying for in your healing area, talk to him right now. Lord, heal my whatever the request is in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, salamakadegishiki. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Ah, oh, yes, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you for the victory, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Ah, oh, yes, Lord. You are so worthy, Lord. Praise your name. Praise your mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. Create in us a clean heart. Anything that is not of your will, remove it right now in the name of Jesus. We commit to letting go any and everything that is not in line with your word and your will, whether it be people, things, environments, memories, we give all those things that are negative, causing unrest, we lift them up to you right now, Lord, and say, take them. We want that peace that surpasses all understanding, Lord. And we receive it right now. We receive the peace of God. The joy of the Lord is within us. And we say thank you. Thank you. Shalom Thank you, Jesus. Shalom Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. We say yes, Lord. 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 God is healing everything right now. God's healing power is touching everything now. Everything we have lifted up in prayer is being healed right now. Receive it, Lord. Where two or three are gathered in your name, there you are also. Thank you, Lord. We lift up all our prayer requests right now. In the name of Jesus, Lord, take them. We give them to you, Lord. Everything in our prayer request is hindering our walk with you. Take it right now in the name of Jesus, Lord. Take them so that we may walk boldly, confidently in your will and your way. Healing power is all around us right now in the name of Jesus. Mark eleven twenty four. Whatever things you desire when you pray, believe 
you have received it and you shall have it thank you Lord the devil is a liar I resist the devil and he will flee and we pray right now Lord we thank you Lord we thank you for our victory of healing healing mind body and spirit Lord complete healing is taking place right now in the name of Jesus complete healing is taking place right now in the name of Jesus hallelujah and just give him praise just give him praise thank you Jesus thank you thank you Jesus 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 we love you Lord I love you Lord thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus Pela bagada sabe que is. Ah, sa 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 kapati kisni. You worthy Lord. You are so worthy Lord. She nala bagisi. You are so worthy. So worthy. Yes Lord. She la magada kiflo bus ni kadaska. Min magada sakatish. Thank you. Thank you Lord. Shagadi kifi. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We continuously seek your face, Lord. We continuously seek your face. Bless us right now, Lord. Bless everyone within the sound of my voice, Lord. That healing is taking place in their lives right now in the name of Jesus. Whatever it is, Lord, whatever it is, Lord, we loose them from it right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Ah, Everything that is not like God is gone right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your healing. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your deliverance. Thank you for peace. Peace. Oh, yes, Lord. We feel your peace surrounding us. We feel your peace flowing through our blood vessels. We feel your peace attaching itself to every concern we previously had but we don't have it any longer Lord because we just gave it to you we are not worrying another day because you shall supply all our need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus and I believe we have received. Yes, Lord. We receive the victory right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Just talk to him. Talk to him. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. 
We bask in your presence. We bask in your presence, Lord. We bask in your peace, Lord. We bask in your healing, Lord. Ah, yes, Lord. We bask in the victory over everything that is distracting our soul and spirit in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Touch everyone right now, Lord, in the name of Jesus. And when this prayer is over, Lord, in the name of Jesus, we take the victory with us into the world, Lord. Slapping the enemy in his face, Lord. For we have walked with the Lord in his presence the past hour in the name of Jesus, Lord. We thank you, Lord. We thank you. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. Praise your name, Lord. Praise your name. Praise your name. Praise your name. Praise your name. Praise you. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. We claim our victory, Lord. We bask in our victory, Lord. Victory is ours in the name of Jesus. Joy is ours in the name of Jesus. Peace of mind is in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Any fear of any anxiety from any challenge is released right now in the name of Jesus. We give it all up to you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. She my love again, if you look at each nigga, but the look at the black at each nigga that's a kiss. Most not the big people of a guinea bit of kiss. Kill a mother, that's a little bit of a kill a mugodooski. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Praise your mighty name. We feel your victory starting right now. Instantaneously, Lord. We feel your healing taking place right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Bask in your healing. Bask in your healing. Share your healing with others in the name of Jesus. Ah, yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We love you, Lord. We worship you, Lord. The devil is alive. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, And as we wind down, Lord, we just bask in thanking you. 
thanking you for all the prayer requests that were lifted the past hour, Lord. We know the victory is ours right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Praise your name. Praise your name, Father. Praise your name, Father. Praise your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Shayla Makadeki seek in the Gadu Pukulakataka ta ta ta. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Shayka the Buddha Sila Bagadish Felagadessa. Kimaka ta 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 Shayla Bagadi go to two. Breeze ne la Pagasa. Rokus nik la Paha. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. All these things, Lord, we ask. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. And as we continue to slowly come out of our relaxation of prayer and meditation, Take a deep breath and four count and in. X. In. X. In. X. Last one in. X. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Lord. And even if you want to stay in this spirit, as this video ends, you feel free to stay in this spirit however long you want. I just wanted to do this version and the other versions so you see what an hour of prayer feels like. But if you feel like the Spirit's still talking to you, you just keep it going. And the Spirit will let you know when everything that's been prayed has been prayed because you then actually feel blank because you've actually let out everything the Holy Spirit has guided you to say and do. And then you just slowly sit up, hold on to that basking and move smoothly back into your day even if it's a crazy day I guarantee you won't have the same reaction as you had before you started this video you will not leave the same way you came if you truly let yourself go seeking the Lord's face this past hour
And that's what it's all about. Communing with the Lord, seeking His face, getting that relationship one-on-one -on -one with Him. And just talking to Him like we talk to another person. He's right here with us through the Holy Spirit. And just speak. And He hears our faintest cry. Our every prayer request. We just lift it up to Him. And then believe we have received it already. And it shall come to pass. Praise God for you. Thank you for supporting our ministry. And above all, may the Lord bless you and keep you in all that you say or do, wherever you go, 24-7. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.